Yesterday, uh, I met someone that said this was the intro. Someone introduced us. Hey, this is Rory. So, yeah, I went to high school with Maul. I was like, I have so many questions. <laughs> it's funny. When people come up to me and say shit like that, I'll be like, yeah, I don't care. I cared. I don't care who you did are. Did you get any information? I did not. I didn't ask any information. I just said that's cool. Yo, you know Roland? No. Then the next five minutes is trying to get you to remember who Come Roland on, you is. you remember at like, Middle fam, East that one time? I don't give a fuck about you or Roland. <laughs> Roland. But you know Roland, though. But I don't want to talk about Roland right now or with you or ever. Shout out to Roland. Yeah, shout out to all the Rolands. No, 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 Joe Biden. No, 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 it's Parks. It's Parks. It's uh, the <laughs> microphone check one two. What is this? The JBP boys. Back to business. Hey everyone. Ryan Mall. Like, when are you guys ever gonna do like some type of participation in things? They don't want to harmonize with us. No, like, what man. the fuck? That was with a harmony supposed to come in. Yeah, no. you're you're the he tenor. Ain't, he ain't even have to harmonize. It was just some, someone. Someone, Back has, to someone business. has to keep this pod grounded. Nah. Nah. Nah, off the ground. Uh, shout out to you guys out there. Hey, you guys. Shout out to our Spotify listenership, our <laughs> YouTube viewership. Shout out to uh, who else, who else, who else? Our first and last time listeners. Shout out to all the ladies. Ladies. Who else are we <laughs> shouting out out there? Shout out to everybody that's working on the weekend. Fuck you, Rory. Uh, shout out to everybody that's home cleaning. Shout out to everybody that's home cooking. Shout out to everybody that, you know what I mean, got big plans for the night, leaving the kids at grandma's house. Hey! That's shout swag. out to every. Body, this is an all-inclusive podcast. Unless you take things personally and suck dick, this is not for you. Kick rocks. Now, with okay. that said, I have an amazing crew here, you guys. Oh, wait, wrong show. Uh, <laughs> wait. Yes, there's not a rig to pan into your face. <laughs> Today on the Joe Budden Podcast. Put it on the gym. Put it on the gym. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm here. <laughs> Erickson, put it on the gym. I love the gym. Uh, here with my nearest and dearest friends. Maul is here. Parks is here. Rory is here. Erickson is here. Savon is here. Alex the Great is here. I'm not sure if Rim is still here. Cheers. Cheers is here. Hey, Rim. Is he the Great today? Yeah. He battled Wyclef. I don't know if he's the Great. Well, he lost. Parks, just why don't you guys get right to all the punchlines about the well, story? I, 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 that was the lead in to tell the story. Yeah. Okay, well, you're not supposed to give away the punchline. I didn't say anything. Lead all I said was he may not be oh, the Great. Care, today. I don't care about it now. Y'all ruined it. <laughs> Y'all talk about it. It was on the internet. What happened? <laughs> Savon and uh, Screen Man were apparently at some sort of event, and uh, Screen Man apparently got challenged to a battle by so none other than Wyclef Jean. Wyclef was the keynote speaker. He was getting some type of award, and in the middle of his speech, he saw Screen Man sitting in the back, pointed to his direction, and said, you, battle now. <laughs> they, went out, they went outside. Wyclef gave him an a, a easy 32, tore him to pieces. Screen Man said, I said, yo... And no yelling happened. <laughs> Why did this happen though? What, what, we're like we're still so trying to get to the bottom of this as well. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know why uh, Screen Man was at a Sony Orchard meeting. He told me because he has friends at Sony Orchard. I said so. <laughs> you don't have to be I everywhere love, your friends I love are. Orchards. Um, I don't know how Wyclef just picked him out of a crowd and said, "Hey, you, let's battle." I don't I mean, know why to, Screen Man... To be the best, you got to challenge the best. I don't know why Screen Man had eight bars in the tuck. I don't know that. Um, a lot is wrong with that story. It's disturbing. And Savon didn't back him up for nothing. Savon was in the background screaming one time every time Wyclef <laughs> hit, a, hit a bar. Yeah, I don't know how you see your man taking such a vicious L and don't jump in, honestly. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. I look at you a little different Yo, now. That's what that. y'all be doing when y'all not around us? Battling the Fujis. <laughs> how, how you name your podcast? Need to know, but don't uh, don't let Wyclef know anything. You was battling pros. <laughs> oh, that's my part right here. I mean, his mom's wondering about this love. Guess what? I'm in trouble. No, I'm screen, in trouble. Screen y'all. man was in trouble. <laughs> I'm in real big trouble, y'all. Come on. This song has some of the greatest ad libs in the world, by the way. <laughs> I'm not cutting it off until the ad libs happen. Hey, Scream Man getting nightmares. Don't worry, audience. <laughs> we're going to pod soon. Hey. Pick up the phone, yo. Yeah. Here we go. 
I'm losing blood, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> so cold. Hey, miracle. So cold. <laughs> <laughs> I love R&B. Hey, man. All right, so let's get started, man. Is R&B dead? <laughs> <laughs> There seemed to be a hot topic this week. <laughs> <laughs> Sit down, you guys. Let yeah. me run you through the hot topics. Yeah. The, hot uh, topics. R&B at everyone in a frenzy. Hey, Scream Man and Savon, anytime y'all go out and venture on your own, never repeat you know me. <laughs> Please, honestly, never say, yo, I do this for the JBP. Like, do this for the Yeah, and I know how niggas do when they get out at the Sony, Sony Orchard meetings. He, he did the battle for the JBP? That's what the, he this was representing was? us. I Te- do this for the JBP. Technically, we lost to Wyclef. As yeah, a collective. now I might have now I might have to see Wyclef. Now I got to see Clef. That's it. Who? Wait, who know me? Yo, don't tell me about what no nigga said to you about me, man. <laughs> that's, that's just rolling. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Money Nels. That name sounds familiar. Who the fuck is he? You sold him laptops. <laughs> <laughs> oh Nel. Oh Nelson. Yeah. Nelson, Nelson, no, 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 you got Nelson, money now, though. Nelson, no, yeah, you got, you got, I got money dollars. now. No, y'all know Nelson. All no, for your laptops, no, probably. Nelson's had money for a long time. Shout out to Nelson. Nelson, I think we're, I, is he at Sony? Wow. Yo, man, I got to applaud you people that, like, Nelson, uh, Gabby, Gabby, uh, Sav again, Steve Carlos again, just because you've been in conversations. Uh, there's a few of y'all that just have made your way in the music business for 20 years. And I don't think we mention it. Yeah, it's a hard yeah. thing to do. Yeah, when you're not very difficult. When you're not guaranteed a job, like some people in music are just guaranteed a job. You can fuck up, blow the budget, blow all the money. Your friend will give you a job over here somewhere. But for the people that that is not the case, that is fucking impressive. Well, that's why Steve and Sav are so dope because they kind of created their job at Def Jam. Mm, yeah, <laughs> like they created their own shit I and, got- and adapted to what was going on when the building was still in old radio mode. You know, you know when you, you know when people are good when, like, if Steve if Steve and Sav were angry at you and put you on like, uh, froze you out, you felt it. You felt the absence of them on your project. <laughs> mm. <laughs> like that is the sign of somebody just being good. Like when yeah. I left Def Jam, I was like, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> really could have used that. I need Steven. <laughs> yeah, uh, but shout out to everybody. Shout out to everybody up there. Uh, shout out to everybody listening. What's up, gentlemen? How y'all feeling? 13 minutes later, how y'all feeling? Y'all feeling all right? Feel good. Yeah, yeah I better. feel pretty good. Low under the weather, but I'm all right. Nah. Still still showed up. Ball got the rotor. <laughs> nah, blood. C- nah. Cut, cut your beard. How you know? You didn't go to no doctor, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have Yo, black people just be talking. <laughs> nah, it's not that. <laughs> how, how do you know nah, it's not he, he would know he would feel it he did not go and get checked for the coronavirus no he did not he would feel it though he did not go to Harlem Hospital you went to Harlem Hospital definitely not you wouldn't that's, go that's, nah, that's nah, where, don't do that. that's where you get it don't do that <laughs> nah. that's where it's at y'all, y'all saying that I, dro- I drove by 135th the other day that shit looked like a new place they spent some money on the front of it. They changed something in there. How's the inside? There's a, there's a higher ceiling. <laughs> there's a grand entrance now over there. It don't look like when my grandma died. <laughs> it don't. It no, looks they make, nice. They make you feel good on a walk-in. Yeah. It's when the, it's they, the walk they out changed there. that. Yeah. I mean, they had to put money into it, though. It's just hollow. But, yo, I noticed the same thing downtown. We was riding around somewhere over there by the Hot 97 building. And I looked to the right, and it was like a whole... Uh, it was a big ass Starbucks, but not a normal Starbucks. It was like the, the size the of a Whole Foods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the Walmart version. And right next to it was something else important. It was like, oh shit! All right, they just—it's just theirs now. <laughs> They're here. <laughs> well, it used to be Starbucks. Now I think Chipotle is now the the tell sign when a neighborhood is changing. Oh yeah. It used to be Starbucks. Now yeah. when I see Chipotle on Jamaica Avenue, I'm like, oh, it's over. They put a Chipotle <laughs> on Starbucks. Sorry guys. Man. I'm mad. Oh, it's happening. Yeah, just yeah. yeah. It's happening. Imagine what Amazon would have done. <laughs> Chipotle on every block. Yeah, we charge for extra guac. Where did uh, Amazon ever land with that? They uh, ended up in the Virginia Lower East Side. No, no, no. They, no, they left. They, 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 they did go somewhere else, but I think they're doing one now in Manhattan somewhere. I don't know if it's the same facility or whatever. But got it. Yeah, all right, got it. Yeah, and they're paying taxes for it. <laughs> How do you know? Well, I'm sure they're not paying taxes, <laughs> but the one in Queens, they wanted New York City taxpayers to pay for them moving in here and their whole shit. I can't believe that Daikon works at Amazon. 
Anyway, <laughs> something totally different. <laughs> Yo, we need Steven Sav at Amazon. <laughs> <Cool>. <laughs> That's what we need. Um, all right, Rory, I'm looking at your computer. Clearly, this story is burning a hole in you. Come on, give it to us about Offset's acting. <laughs> Come on. Wait, what? Jeez, I'm looking at your computer right there. This is Offset? No, but it, well, he was there. Don't do that. You moved him. Wait, where was Offset? You moved him when my joke was coming. What was he I don't see him. I didn't even touch my computer. What, well, what was he tell him, Rory. I don't know. Tell me. Offset was acting in NCIS. Oh, with, I'm here for that. With LL Cool J. Oh, I'm definitely here for Missed that. It. And it looked like he did a good job. Quavo was in uh, Narcos, Mexico. Really? He was a drug dealer. And they were in Atlanta as drug dealers. He was... Uh, Oh, the show. No, no, I wasn't. A, I wasn't a joke. They were, <laughs> no, they were. Yo, what type of snitching is going on here? <laughs> no, the show. Rory, no, the show. Rory, it's on Rory, the show. Rory. But you can't say that, Rory. You're right. Don't I can't. That. The show. And ATL. They was in Atlanta. And they were drug dealers in the show. There. In the show. That's fun. Oh. All right, tell the In the show. Your honor, I really meant in real life. <laughs> Yo, if Rory ever has to take the stand, I'm going. By the way. To support me, right? <laughs> yes. Okay, thanks. I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm going to snitch on you. Yeah, I was going to say, don't, don't, don't go. I'm just pointing right at you. Hey, I don't know if y'all been keeping up with 50's show uh, for life, but they let that jailhouse lawyer have it in the last episode. <laughs> they tore his ass up in there. <laughs> well, <laughs> It's only funny if you watch the I haven't show. seen it. Uh, yeah, uh, Damn, uh, man, y'all got to support. It's, it's on my list. I'm going to watch Well, he's, the, he's the president so. of Def Jam now. No, he's not, bro. Really. <laughs> he is. 50 would never troll. <laughs> Everything he says on Twitter is true. Yeah. A bunch of people start hitting me about, about that. Like, fam, he's not serious. <laughs> <laughs> you'll, you'll get a formal announcement from somewhere if this really happens. This no, this, this, nah, this, things are changing. This, he's changing shit up there. This is, I'm announcing it on Twitter with an emoji. <laughs> fuck, fuck Billboard. I wonder if 50 would take that job. No. He wouldn't I take that know. job. He definitely wouldn't no. take that job. Y'all are quick to say no. No. He might. I don't. I, yeah, I don't know. I think fifty. I, don't know what, I think fifty knows the commitment it would take for that, and I don't think he has the time. Does it? Don't go off what Paul did. He would just talk about the, the <laughs> like the actual job description. He would just he would just make Yayo do it. Fam, <laughs> I'm going back to Def Jam if Yayo is the president. I want to sit in in every meeting. <laughs> Roy want to go back anyway. That's true. You coming yeah. with me? Hell no. Come on. I want to go too. Never. Shit. No, Never. Find out what you don't think the pod could run Def Jam? I do. I do too. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> Actually it would be kind of the perfect staff. We, would, oh, yeah. <laughs> we could do everything right I, here. I think yeah. we would get shit lit. Hell Honestly. Yeah. I wouldn't take that job. <laughs> I'm not taking I'm not touching it. Would you take that job, Rory? You would. Mm. But speak no. speak the yes, you would. No. President of Death You know why I wouldn't. Rory would definitely take I would I would take president. Would absolutely absolutely yeah. Take what is Rory talking about? Oh, all right. In a hypothetical situation, yes. I have and something you would go where on, like tomorrow <laughs> now. <laughs> and you would go in there cracking the whip. Oh, for sure. <laughs> like for you sure. would straighten shit up. No, but here's the thing. I'm hiring Maul off rip. <laughs> oh no, you have to. You have Maul to. is my first hire. Right, you have so to. you the same as Paul. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see a difference. Yeah, Maul's not white. Ah, you got me there. See, that's the start. Change. <laughs> Let me try to think of what Rory's first order of business is on Def Jam. Uh, I, all right, I, get I, Biebs in here. Biebs. <laughs> uh, because I'm a good friend, I would sell you back uh, all your publishing to pump it up. Oh, man, look at you. Yeah. That's nice of you. Man. I'd make Parks and A&R for $1.5 that I just found go. out is the salary. Let's go. <laughs> like, I don't think that's the salary, That by can't the way, be. Of, that's crazy. Uh, that's, that's just not the going salary for A&Rs. I'm sure not, no. Okay. Not, not even that's at the height that's of, of A&Ring. <laughs> no, 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 no. I know. I know. Well, not, yeah, not the going rate. That's, yeah, yeah. No, you I know. know. No, Superstar got A&Rs it. got that. I know what Skane was making when uh, after he popped Ludacris off. <laughs> well, uh, whoa. <laughs> In music terms? Uh, it's cool. I'm with you. Come on, man. Yeah, that was nasty. Hey, you starting some rumors. I'm saying, fucking, uh, yeah, Skane might have been hotter in that building than me. Well, yeah, he was. Uh, that's he that's was, how Joe. I got my deal. He was, <laughs> definitely was. That, that's how I got my deal. I know what he made. That was a lot. Jay took your beat and only shouted out Skane. <laughs> <laughs> he told Skane he'd give it back. He didn't even tell Joe he'd give it back. He said, yo, Skane. Don't, don't worry, bro. <laughs> Call me a little artist. I'm going to give it back. That was disrespectful. It really was. <laughs> don't shout my a and out. <laughs> and call it a jack move. 
Don't get and on. Then proceed to call you Harold. Don't Leiter get on the time. front of a of a of a disc. Purvis Ellison. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> don't get on, funny show. Don't get on the front of a disc and start talking about how great your relationship is with my A and R. That's corny. <laughs> After you turned me down for the remix and then remixed it. <laughs> yeah, for free. <laughs> <laughs> for your tape. <laughs> I, I, and then Joe came back. Oh, I'm back again. Thanks, Jay. <laughs> Killed it though. Yeah, I like the yeah. remix. Yeah, no, no the version no, no. I have has See, you too. This, this is the remix of the is, remix. This is when your little jokes got to stop because you were well, outside. You remixed the remix. Joe did what yeah. he had to do. I was outside then. It. That's the time I came did outside. Did you put pump it up remix, remix? Remix. Yeah, you double. You doubled down on the remix. <laughs> we're gonna talk about something soon. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, we are. <laughs> uh, well, what do y'all want to talk about? Uh, things happened. Uh, want to go right to music? Once, no, a, once, upon, never, once upon a time, we were a music pop. I, I don't ne- feel like any music came out. I never, not much music. Rory has a whole list of music. Well, no, that that's not true. Party a dropped music a, came out. Party today. dropped a fire single. A fire single. A fire single. <laughs> I thought it was fire. Yeah. No, it's hard. Oh, my bad. <laughs> that's a hard record. Yeah. I'm only laughing at a, a, a fire single. That's all. That's what the sticker said. <laughs> on the, I knew. I knew the album wasn't up. happening. Though. I knew that. <laughs> Is it a smash? Yeah, it's a smash. <laughs> I like that song a lot. Party Next Door put out a record from his Party Mobile project <laughs> that he also P, P- Mobile <laughs> that he also announced <laughs> that he also announced was dropping March 27th. This is back from Christmas. Party Mobile. <laughs> I've been waiting for Party Mobile since Christmas. <laughs> Party Mobile. Car was in the shop. That's a new, that's a new ride share Party program. Party Mobile is hilarious. <laughs> they had to wait to get insurance. The car, yeah, the car was in the shop. You know, you Man, no, they bring, ride the car without insurance. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they bring it back to Party Bus. It's just the Party Mobile now. Yeah, Party Mobile. The funny <laughs> shit is there ain't been a party song to come off this nigga th- shit yet. Well, no, loyal. Loyal. What you mean? And Bad News. There was a two-pack. Nah, Bad News was before that, wasn't it? Nah, they came together. Oh, they did? Together, yeah. Who's the most informed podcast out? <laughs> it's us. <laughs> Did the weekend drop anything today? Huh? We didn't talk about the weekend song that he dropped last week, but let's finish talking about party yeah. next door. Since before the podcast, you said, "Yo, man, we've been really hard on parties last few weeks." So I want to come on here and give him some praise. I do. So do it. <laughs> I really, really like the record. I like the concept. Yeah, this record is dope. Uh, this is that party we was waiting on. This is the type of party I like. <laughs> <laughs> this is that party that you this this nah, this, the party this is that party right here, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it talk, is too, but I'm in, that shit. I'm in a silly mood. I'm just laughing nah, shit, but talk that shit. <laughs> he smoked this. Why did he give us the Vice City Grand Theft Auto <laughs> fucking artwork? Yeah, T Rex is fucking in there. <laughs> <laughs> For the hourly Ain't rate. nobody in there but T Rex and his man. <laughs> and his and man. They, and they boogie on the TV. <laughs> <laughs> they went to the lobby said, uh, <laughs> hey, boogie. <laughs> You leave Boogie out of this. No, he's on the TV. <laughs> y'all, y'all, y'all shut up because T-Rex is looking for me now, man. So shut Damn. up. T-Rex looking for you? Yeah, I'm hiding. Just put a uh, scream, <laughs> scream in on him. And you ain't peace. You ain't dead it for me neither. <laughs> I ain't crazy. know you, but why you looking for you? Because you ain't dead it. <laughs> That's kind of crazy you didn't dead that, though. Like, no, Honestly, that's your department. Look, you're smiling now, too. Because he know. <laughs> that's just funny that Rex is looking for you. That's funny. Why? He wants to come on our podcast and talk. Oh. oh. We said looking for you like he mad. Oh, I don't know. I didn't speak to him. Oh, okay, Something Maybe he's mad. Him. I don't know. Nah, Rex ain't mad at that shit. How you know? Rex know that was a crazy vid. <laughs> he <laughs> might not know. He know that, man. He know that. <laughs> Everybody Yo, we, cool. we, we, we cut off a fire single to discuss this. <laughs> 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 again, turn this shit back on. <laughs> I'm telling y'all, one of y'all better get some news out today. I'm going to just laugh at shit. <laughs> hey, party, you've been going too long to give me your voicemails. <laughs> nah, I need it. I need a voicemail party. It is fire when the voicemail Who's is still always. Voicemail. Nah, me, only me. only in music. <laughs> <laughs> you would leave a voicemail. I do. Shorty don't even know her passwords or her voicemail <laughs> or how to check it. <laughs> pause it. Pause it. Kind of sounds no, like you your impression of Drake. Pause it. <laughs> Yo, a little bit. He's so right, it, though. It, it does. It sounds exactly sounds like Joe's like impression of Joe's Drake. Joe's impression of Drake. <laughs> 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 That's funny. <laughs> does it? Yes. It definitely does. Yo, why why can you always see it in a chick's face when she has to make a split decision? <laughs> <laughs> I love that she went through his phone. Oh, it won't get me there again. 
and said, mm-hmm. you, you found some things you should have never found. <laughs> now make a decision right now. He's smoking this. Mm. Hey, when that happens. You shouldn't have found them. <laughs> What's your you problem? Found anyway, she found these things? She shouldn't have been looking. Yeah. It's going to be hard to repair the trust after that party. Mm. <laughs> Yo, I ain't going to pause this. I ain't going to lie. Some of my favorite R&B might, might be the, the guy's perspective of, hey, I'm the worst guy in the world, but now you'll never love me again. <laughs> yeah. That's the best. It's honest. That's why I fuck with Chris Brown so much. No, I, 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 like, my, I like my R&B. Yeah, he's the king. Yeah. Toxic. I like my RB toxic. I don't really like it too lovey. Sidebar, random question. Does uh does KC have the uh best R and B ad lib of all time? Oh yeah. Come on, man. That's one of them. Uh does Carl well, Thomas well, got something in there? What's the second? What's who's comes in second or third? Just think about it. I know it's a random question. You can think about it. We'll come back to it later. But <laughs> I couldn't think of a second. Come back to it later. I couldn't think of a second. No, that's probably number one. That has to be the most recognizable R&B ad lib. I recognize it when other people do it. Mm. There's got to be a Carl. Carl Thomas was good at that shit, too. I nah, feel like Case he, is somewhere in this conversation. Y'all naming niggas that ain't coming nowhere close to a, a no, I feel like, I feel about I feel like two. Case has a, like, a real recognizable ad lib. Well, give it I can't, to me. I can't remember it, but I feel like, I feel like it's one. But Casey, yes, for sure. Okay. Absolutely, without a doubt. All right, listen, man. <laughs> nah, verse two, he giving it up. All right, this is plagiarism. <laughs> plagiarism? <laughs> no, it's not. We can't, there's a word for when you play the whole song. Copyright? Yeah. Plagiarism? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> it's not plagiarism. Now we're analyzing. It's uh, fair use. Yeah, we're not. Nah, nah, let verse four rock out. Nah, yeah. nah, <laughs> this is not ours. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's a string. We don't. Nah. It's, no, on, it's on Spotify. They don't divvy it up we like on, that we just on, yet. We on Spotify. Weekend, your move. What you gonna do, famo? <laughs> famo. <laughs> Weekend. Ball is in your court. That's the best. What, what I hate when a girl tells you that, though. The uh, ball is in your court. <laughs> I don't even want to be at this court. I don't play ball the anymore. Ball is in my court. I'm out. Um... We didn't talk about that weekend record that came out last week. Uh, After Hours? Mm-hmm. Pretty good. Come on, let's keep the competition going. Which song's better? Which song's better? Mm. This one or that let's one? Let's get a little bit of weekend. Oh. Hold up, Rory. Let me do it. Oh, no, I mean, over here, because you be, I mean. I'll be playing verse four. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let me give him a little taste. <laughs> oh, take that. Production course more than yours. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on. Yeah. <laughs> da, da. Go check mm, who mixed my shit. I don't know, y'all. If you're listening, if you're watching at home, tell us in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we became those guys. Hey, hold up now. Hold up now. Hey, all that party mobile shit is cool, but hold up now. <laughs> Uh, and that's Rory Bag. He's from right now. That's, I love his record. This, that's his bag. Yeah. Hell yeah. Look, Parks, you see it? That's my bag. Look, look at so Mo. Mo, so that's the tightest head nod because that's your man party. Nah, so I'm just saying. <laughs> yo, yo, loosen up that head nod, my G. You rolling with the weekend in this beef? I don't know. That's a different question. Okay. Slow down. Don't no, do I'm that. just asking. But don't, don't, don't ask me when the beat is off. Let's okay. keep jamming. Get that head nod back popping. Huh? Got your head, head uh, bobbing because your neck nose is fresh. This your first time here in Sparks? What do you think? Uh, I think I heard it the first day, but I didn't go back to it. Uh, I like that he tried to flip when chicks say, I had a dream, and they get mad at you about the dream they had. They love doing it. And that. he flipped it on him. He was like, Yo, I died in my dream, though. <laughs> now you don't even care. This is a great record. It is. That's yeah. a great record. Sounds good. They're both great records. I'm real happy that Party put out a song that I can go back to a lot. Yeah. Sounds like a Party song. This is what I miss from Party. This is the style of music I miss from Party. Okay, so this is coming out on March 20th. And Party comes out a week later, March 27th. 
2020, 2020? Okay, so Didn't okay. we say all of this? I feel like we are the only people that have been live commentating this. What do you mean? Well, yeah. Them going head to head? We called them dropping a week apart. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Before they announced this. Like, we've been on this for a while. Now, Maul, back to your question. Come on. Let's ask this and, and nip this in the bud for good. Mm. Yeah. Once and who, for who, all. Who are you mm. taking in this, in this uh, R and beef? What is what criteria? Be- better album? Better album, better music. Better music so far, on, on the album. Better content. So far, Weekend's winning this. On the uh, album. Yeah. Right? Album. This isn't a fair fight. Why? Sure it is. This is like the U.S. versus Grenada. Like, one has mad money <laughs> and mad production and every resource you can fucking find. You don't think, I, I think Party has yeah, He's got a couple dollars. Resource. Party's got Drake and Rihanna. Yeah. yeah, you got a couple dollars. I would love to know Weekend's recording budget and Party's recording budget. You know that already. <laughs> Weekend's recording budget is fifty million dollars. Yes. Party's recording budget <laughs> is fifty thousand. He's at the crib. It, yeah, he's, yeah, he does it mean, himself. Yeah. And it's fire. He's, yeah. in, he's recording in the car, Party Mobile. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's a concept album. Yeah. <laughs> it's, really life, it's a lifestyle. It's like Sergeant yeah. Pepper. Yeah, it's a lifestyle. <laughs> um. It's like Sarge so far, <laughs> I have weekend winning this so far with based off songs released. Yes, I have so weekend far. winning because I don't think it's fair. No, it's it's. I think it's fair. Okay, party has resources. Who do you think will have the better album though? Weekend. Weekend. I'm rolling. Over I there. might like parties better. I want to like parties better. Party has the potential from uh, for me to like his shit more. Mm. When he's at his, when he's in his bag, that's the album that I'm probably going to play through the summer, through next fall, through next winter. I'm still on the first two projects. I play them like that. Like, yeah. that's why I have a certain loyalty to party because you gave me the soundtrack to too many amazing summers for me to just throw you to the wayside like fickle fans normally do. I won't do it. But you're so noble. But to say that I am, I am. That's one now, of, we that's can hit some of my soundtr- summer soundtracks too. What? Let's be clear. That beauty created joint. Yeah. What summer was that? The thirteen, maybe. It was when Cl- it was when Club Deco in Edgewood oh, was popping. That was more like fifteen. <laughs> Either way, no weekend had. He did. Beauty he had created a couple good songs, but Madness. all the points that Rory brings up. I think it up, depends on what type of drugs you want. All the points oh, that sure. Rory brought yeah, up, similar though, drugs about the weekend having more, uh, more tools, uh, more assets, more resources. That that happened early in Weekend's career versus I think Party's career taking a different. But I course. think that yeah, but I, uh, Party has a lot of resources too. He's he does, but it's a different when you got pop star like pop star resources. Like when you're the number one priority. It's not that different when you can just call the pop stars and have them do verses for you. I'm talking more production level and how things are going to sound. It's going to be extremely polished. So that actually might get in the way of weekend when his shit gets too polished. You act like OVO don't got some good fucking producers and engineers over there. I have a, a, amazing. A Forty Top might be the, the best, <laughs> but it just doesn't go next to. What weekend's gonna dump money into? I think weekend will have the better album. I'm looking forward to party's album more. I think party will have the. Better I think album. weekend will have a bigger album. I'm I'm stealing your answer. Yeah. I'm looking more forward to parties. Yeah, but I think weekend will have better. When midnight comes, I'm clicking. Party I'm going first. to party first. Absolutely. Even though it's, they're they're coming out on separate weeks. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm, still, I'm still going. Oh, I'm to, no, I'm <laughs> saying on, when when party drops, that's the first album I'm going to. Even if the algorithms don't put it in my top, I'm going to search for that album. Mm. I'm gonna treat the party album. I'm really gonna sit down and listen to it. Then, top, like as soon as it comes out, y'all gonna have chicks come through when you listen to it, or are you just gonna no, like be in your own When I listen to music vibe? for the first time, you gotta have, you gotta be by yourself. Mm. Mm. People like to talk. But party though, yeah, you saw a I feel you though. No, you know you know they, right. they want to tell you what's right. going on on Instagram. Yeah. Like I don't want to hear about that. Unless but you're that, with other kinda, music nerds that can like know how to appreciate yeah. and analyze quick they listening to yeah. get in and out. Yeah, more, but that's kinda but, that's but, kinda the, the not the point of party's music, but him at his best is when you have the women that you're not supposed to be around that only want to talk about Instagram and that's playing in the background. We have to figure out which girl you want over for the party. Yeah, record. that's why you gotta listen to the album first and then you know which girl to invite. Yeah. Or which girls to invite. Over. I ain't gonna lie. When you catch that vibe though, like when you meet the girl who you feel like appreciates music the way that you do and you just could sit and listen to a song together. <laughs> See, yeah. party's albums for the it's girls. A different feeling. Party's albums for the girls that come in and they take <laughs> they their shoes off me. before they walk in. That's what the party's albums. Weekend albums for the girls that come in and 
go straight to the raw tray and start oh, rolling that, up. Oh, that's a great. No, great oh, wait, hold up, Ray. That's a great mistake topic by by Maul. Give me give me the small the the small gesture from a girl that you really appreciate, like something like that. Like the girl just comes over and takes her shoes off, like without you asking her. Yeah, I love mm. that. I like when yeah. anybody come over and take their shoes off. Like that's, yeah, that's a sign of respect. Yeah. Canadians do that though. I don't know if y'all know that. Like guys and women from Canada, they'll come in and they'll take their shoes off as soon as they like this some of the toughest niggas I know in Canada that come in your crib and they'll just take their shoes off. Yeah, I'm like, fam, yeah, but they get tax they get tax breaks. They get a lot of yeah, snow. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they got mad. But I appreciate that though. I like girls that come in, take their shoes off. I like girls that come in and they'll see something that's dirty, they'll just start like wiping stuff and cleaning up. I appreciate that too. <laughs> So you like maids? No, no, no. I just like, I just like service. that. Like, you know what I'm saying? What if, it, what if I'm just like, it's just shit no, on the table? It's no, like, I feel you, bro. I just start, yeah. in, start cleaning up a little. Like sometimes bit. they start organizing my closet. Yeah, I, I like, like when they come over and pick up the mess, see, see yeah. some laundry, yeah. start doing like laundry. That, that sounds I, horrible, but I understand what he's saying. No, I, well, no, I, I know what he's saying. Too. I like that. Yeah. I like that type of shit. I had chicks offer to come over and clean, like bring their moms over. It's like, oh, y'all run a cleaning service. <laughs> yeah, I like that type of shit. What do you charge? <laughs> you have to text me through TaskRabbit. <laughs> Ma'am, you are a cleaning lady. <laughs> you are not trying to link. Ma'am, I'm not going to fuck you and let you mop, man. I'm just not going to do it. Yeah, that's tough. Well, not I the feel same a little day. bad. <laughs> not in the same day. This is horrible. Anywho. Yeah. Anyway. So, yes, is part- R&B really, de- <laughs> really dead? No. R&B but part- I think party is for the chicks that take their shoes off. I think party is for the chicks you meet at the club and say, do you got weed? <laughs> that's, the, that's the only way I'm going to the after movie. That's, the chick, that's what she says to you? It, will it be weed at the spot? Yeah. That, that's the chicks party say it chick, the wrong way like that, too. <laughs> do you have weed? Party is for the chick. <laughs> Party is for the chick that been done with you, but it's just gonna keep letting you be. Of course, she's high. Party makes music for the girls. Toxic sex is the best. Girls wear boy shorts that listen to party. <laughs> girls listen to weekend and wear nothing. Yeah, what happened to boy, sh- uh, boy shorts, man? That's a good question. You know what? Did happened. IG kill? Did the IG thong kill? Facet, it, like, yes. huh? Put on some facet. What happened to boy shorts? What happened? Once facet started making a, that lingerie, it was over for boy uh, shorts, man. The truth is, women don't really know what we find sexy. We like boy like, shorts. They killed boy shorts because they didn't think it was cool. We but did. We loved it. Yeah, loved it. That's the same way they hate themselves in like sweatpants or dress down, and we, we love, love it. Shit, it's man. not till it goes in a rap song that they start repeating shit. <laughs> no, they they think <laughs> he that chilling with no makeup on, bitch. You always have makeup on. That's not true. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he said, I "Hope you don't take this wrong." No, they uh-huh. think they think go out and walk outside in a bathing suit. And Air Maxes, and that's our, that's our favorite thing. That's not. I'm so sick of these chicks wearing bathing suits, and a beach in sight, no sand around, <laughs> no water, no spa. <laughs> I kind of feel bad for like the chicks that really like sneakers, because I feel like the bartenders kind of killed Harachis for the girl sneakerheads. Mm-hmm. No, you you still at that age? You 29, right? Mm-hmm. Like, you can still fuck girl sneakerheads. <laughs> <Wait>. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> you don't like sneakers? I'm alone on that one. All right. You don't like sneakers? Right, hey, I'll stand on the left. No, 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 no. I need to hear more. You don't like sneakerheads? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even really sure. Are y'all serious? <laughs> yeah. You don't like girls that got a, like, a, a dope sneaker collection? Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Am I 12? <laughs> I'm just asking you. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? No, nah, Joe's right. Joe's one of y'all, hundred percent. One of y'all, yo, one of y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, y'all can't believe y'all dead ass. My fucking old bitch wearing Jordan threes. <laughs> well, she got the cements on me too. No, bitch, get what, sexy. But what if no. she got the, what if she got the cool no, bag? He no. Now I go and her room. She her sneaker rack is ill. <laughs> no, where's a heel? No, 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 you no. You can't no. wear this here. No, no, no. Girl sneaker has gold. Oh, this is pergola. Get, no, get you a girl that can do you're both. Not, yeah, you're not yeah, getting yeah. in and you're... No, I'm talking about the ones that can do both. Nah, nah, nah. That ain't what you said. That ain't what you no, said. No, but most, but don't get it twisted, though. Because the girls that can do both, I'm not calling them the girl sneaker head. No, 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 but that's the The girl sneaker head hate wearing... The, the shoes that the chicks we want to fuck nah, should nah, nah, nah. be that's wearing. A that's they just, hate no, that's that's no, no, no. That's not true. The girls, the girls, the, the, hey, the girls we want to fuck, they ain't wearing them. They take them off as soon as they can. No, no, no. I'm talking about the girls that just, they know what dope sneakers are. And they have All right, you, them. But they also you, have dope heels too, though. 
You because if you know shoes, you know shoes. I know what shell toe pussy is like too, and I'll pass. <laughs> Listen, you wrong right there. I'm, 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 I'm not letting I'm you not get fuck, that off. I'm not yeah. fucking nothing. It's I don't see shell tops. What, what about Chucks? Mean? What about Chucks? Nah, yeah. Joe. Yeah, 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 yeah. Joe, I know in your youth. Chucks, you, Vans. You tripping. I know a little some, bit, but that's a not a good pair of jeans and some Jordan ones. Got some good pussy. I'm never fucking a chick in Jordan ones. What? Jordan's well, I'll be at 40 all, period. years old. You I will be crazy. 40 years Joe, old. Joe is crazy. I will be 40 years old. You crazy. What bro. the fuck? Do, all right, man. I'm shutting up. Joe. I always let them reel me in nah, somehow, I, man. Yeah, I'm with Jordan Joe. ones. Joe. Or where you mean her? Any Jordan. The, 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 the court? Anyway, <laughs> any <Of> Jordan, <laughs> she had the rucker. Where do you meet this girl? Any basketball shoe? Nah, period. I, I, quite just came, I just came from Lavo. It wasn't one person in there. And Bill Jordan. No, but ones. if you're going out, no, I'm talking about like this. Women wear sneakers on you know any day. If they're not doing something where it requires to wear heels, like no, we'll have have fun walking around Manhattan <laughs> shopping. They wear sneakers. Joe is we'll Joe is acting like the best head isn't from the chicks that wear black A ones, horrible jeans, and no belt. Rory, <laughs> I, I never want to be intimate with this person Black you're Air describing. Force ones, bro. Horrible jeans and no belt. I don't want to be intimate with the person that Rory's describing fired. right now. Black yo, Air Force ones. And yo, I know we, yo, jeans. we joke around a lot on this I'm podcast. I'm totally joking. So, you know, we'll misrepresent ourselves sometimes just on the strength of the audience. Always. But let me be clear. So, hold up. Let me ask you something. I've been up my level of fucking. Hold up. So, so the chick who wear, who's wearing the Dingy jeans. <laughs> so let me ask you something. You don't think India Love with, is sexy? With no belt. No. You don't think India Love is sexy? No. Which, which one I is India not. Love? You tripping. I can't. I can argue you what tripping. I'm saying, but I cannot publicly. You, you tripping, my nigga. Who's I don't. The, India who's, Love is sexy. who's India Love? I think her sister's sexier than her. India Love is. I don't. I, I'm telling you, Joe's opinion. I'm not saying she's the sexiest, but if you tell me you don't think India Love is sexy, you tripping. That's a sexy oh, this, girl. Uh, how she moves make her mad, unattractive. To me. And, that's, and that's all I see. <laughs> unattractive? How she yes. moves. She's a beautiful, she's makes, a beautiful girl, makes but her I know what they're Unattractive saying. to me. That's, I'm, with, I'm with Rory. Y'all think that girl is yeah, unattractive? Yeah, I didn't y'all was talking about. Yes. How she moves Ma, make her, makes her mad, unattractive. We can't have this conversation, but there's about 20 of them that aesthetically look great that are would be a nightmare to fuck. That's nasty. Ew. Okay. Can you take India Love off the screen, screen man? <laughs> <laughs> horny ass nigga. I you lose, are, you lose are the Wyclef and be you horny. You are on no ground <laughs> yeah, to you, accuse yeah. people of being horny. Yeah, no. You have you no have right. videos of me? <laughs> yes, you. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking horny potter. <laughs> Horny Potter. <laughs> How them keys look? Are they real shiny? Hey, that's a good one, buddy. Rory, those keys shiny? I'm, bro, I'm not even looking this way. <laughs> what y'all doing y'all computers? <laughs> Beat off. <laughs> <laughs> Res- responsibly close the window Word, outdoors. I, I don't bring it to the I, podcast. I didn't know it was still there. <laughs> y'all don't get disgusted with yourself right after y'all like jerk off? I used to. I used to. I, I'm proud of it now. <laughs> You did that. Don't look at me when you say you're proud to jerk. <laughs> you said you'd be like, you be like, yo, you asked me a yeah, question. Yeah, but she was looking right at me when you said I'm proud. But you asked. Yeah, but look that way. You Don't probably, like, you talking, yo, eyes. good job, Joe. I'm shutting up yo, now. You bodied that because shit. I will be the only <laughs> yo, one that, that was one this of the conversation best. <laughs> and then I'll be getting judged. So whatever. No, I, I used to feel a way immediately after I busted. Now I really don't care at all. I never, I, I don't can't think believe y'all said I don't think I ever gave sexy. That's crazy. She's a very pretty girl. How she moves makes her unattractive. I watched her get fisted in a park. What are you telling me? No, I'm not running to her. <laughs> That's not what I asked. I asked if you got I think it was sexy. fisted. Let's, let's slow down. <laughs> but then again, Joe. Fisted is good. What, wow. what if you're She's in a park? foot five. How much shit would feel like a fist? <laughs> Okay. If you fist her, you That's can pick teach her up. Teach his own. You know, teach his own. It's okay. Teach his own. Fam, didn't I come in here last week and say, I think, and you know what's funny? A lot of the women that I feel this way about, I do think are some of the most beautiful women on the planet. I can't name them. But shit, that's probably why I'm att- attracted to hoes. <laughs> the hoes are really beautiful, and sometimes you just be wishing that they saw the beauty. When you say hoes, you mean happiness over oh, everything? Is that this, this is what 2500 sounds like. <laughs> yeah, I just I wish, wish you would see the beauty you within yourself. what I see in you. It's true. Just wish you saw what I, I saw. I, I, know, I know we can't talk about this here because we're immature, and, and that's how we get our audience. But it, it, that's how I feel. No, that's I, how I feel. Because and I you start a, talking to some of these some of these chicks that look really good, but they act how they act and just get into 
where they come from, their thinking, their home, their parents, and you will you will feel bad. You will. No, no, I, if you I, have a heart, I tell you, I tell <laughs> you why why I like why I like hoes, and it's not that hoes have life experience. Like they're some of the coolest chicks because they've experienced the most. They've been in the most situations. They've seen most no, of the we country. Bought, we bought, yeah. Like hoes are mad cool they've to talk seen to. Most of the country. <laughs> Like, it was they're well traveled. <laughs> like you ever just you ever just talk to a hoe and like get her life story? <coughs> shit is better no, than a Netflix original. No, you're right. It's I tell the you, greatest right. shit ever. Hoes, hoes have the best right. stories in the world. Ever. Absolutely. Right. Hoes have the best. They're the most in the world. interesting people. Like period. It's, it's true. Absolutely. Yeah, they're like sponges. <laughs> Wait, and they have, they have a story, and uh, they be. <laughs> 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 I've never, never looked at a sponge's story that way. <laughs> sponges, they, 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 they've, they've washed a lot of dishes. Yeah, yeah, they they hear that's not what people mean when they <laughs> say sponge. I mean, you know, they're sponges. <laughs> they're sponges. They soak right. up game. You know? <laughs> they're wet. They soak up game. They soak up game. You know? Holy shit. <laughs> You know what's you know what's funny to pay attention to? <laughs> we ain't talking about shit. Shit, not one thing. Fun. You know what's funny to pay attention to? I go in a strip club now, and I pay attention to the bartenders looking at people's watches. <laughs> mm. That's a real fun game for me now. I never paid attention uh, to that that's before. That's the fun game to you. The fun game is looking at the bartender's watch for me. <laughs> Her Apple Watch. No, no, no. You got bartenders <laughs> yeah. fucked up. Word. I'm joking. The bartenders got on sixty thousand dollars. Oh, watches. for sure. Mm, yeah. That's that's the fun part for me. <laughs> now you want to shoot from the mountain, do rack, huh? <laughs> No, I'm just saying that's the fun part. Like no, no but, get, in, but get no, but get into no. You cooking now? No, I'm just saying. A, you said the fun I part love is them all say some shit and they, then pull it back. Cause. No, but they because because you looking at it like they're looking at the watch, but they looking at the watch to see like well, nigga, if my watch costs shit. more than your watch, then I don't need. I'm not talking respecting to you. you. Yeah, that's what it is. I bought my watch. <laughs> I was like, just about to say that. Like with she my money. Too. She did too. With but, her does money. That, but does that matter? No. Bought. Yeah, I No, she no. didn't. <laughs> she did not buy it. I'm Joe bought, bought the watch. <laughs> yeah. I mean, no, no, I won't buy me a watch. No. I definitely ain't buying it. I didn't a say you bought watch. it at one time. Yeah. Spotify won't buy it. Saves it up. If 10 niggas is spending 2500 we know the rate. 2000 in a week, she could have 100000 Well, no, that's watch. why they're smart because they don't spend their money. So no, they got it. They could afford it. They don't buy it though. I don't. I don't think it's that much money in the streets, small like like it used to be. I'm not you used to go to Sin City and just be surrounded. It's not surrounded by dope boys that were spending. It's not two grand a night. No, 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 it's not. But tonight that's... you might get one dude to come out and spend that. Yeah, but the thing is, you got they have access to so many, you know, entertainers and athletes and millionaires now. So. That's really the flow of it now, because because the the money doesn't seem to be circulating in the streets like it once was. The gravitation toward rappers and athletes. I'm mad we're doing a strip club deep dive now, but the gravitation toward <laughs> and, rappers and, and athletes has intensified. Yes, it's intensified a bit. The game is advanced now. Yeah. Anyway, um, party, yeah, party mobile. Is, is it advanced? It's just a, a click of a DM. No, no, it's advanced. <laughs> no, the game is advanced. You 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 opened with we got hoes versus hackers. We we are advanced. <laughs> the hackers are always gonna win, man. I want to shout out the hackers. I have Definitely. no I have no beef with no, y'all. That's like I'm, I'm, paper rock. I don't know. I don't know about that. Who's the hackers hoe? Wait, hackers. Yeah, I guess hackers. Who's got hackers hoes. got the hoes. Who's his hoe? Hackers hoe? got the hoes. His hoe might get mad one day and end his whole hack career. <laughs> but he will be replaced by another hacker. The game don't change, just the players. I thank the Lord for this hacker. No, the game changes. It yeah. definitely changes. He was doing work. Hacker, right? What yeah. is this? School and rules. I've been off the I've been off the grid for two days. Oh, oh my, oh out, my you god! You didn't check the group chat. Oh my no, god! <laughs> you ain't see the, the torrent? Is that how you pronounce it? I think Mo, I did. Mo hasn't checked that group chat in well over a year, <laughs> <laughs> or any of our group chats. What is yeah. this? Uh, the hackers got a hold of the OnlyFans database and leaked everyone's <laughs> OnlyFans in an organized folder form. <laughs> <laughs> Alphabetical. I, like, listen, yes, whatever. Mom. The hacker shit is cool. To organize it the way they organized it yeah. was nuts. Every so naughty wait, video. They're up to about three terabytes last yeah, time I checked. Yeah. All of them. Name your name a girl. She's wait, there. Wait, She's wait, there. Okay, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> name one. So every girl that has an OnlyFans. It's out there. Their account has been leaked. Correct. So you don't have to pay for it. Correct. And you can see, like, full videos. All the content. Everything. And this hasn't been. You want to see her suck yet? off her man's from around the way? It's right there. <laughs> it's really, it's right in the inbox. 
The little red bubble on the text text chat. Oh God, I know they're going crazy right now. This is just I I have no beef with any of the hackers. No nah, hackers. Like, are you greatest. guys, I want to be friends. Man. <laughs> Leave this me alone. Is, this is some legendary. Let me know. Yo yo. <laughs> have we ever seen? If anything I can help like in any way. Have we seen anything like this before? Uh, I mean, they took all of our data, like our social security <laughs> numbers and shit, but. <laughs> We've never seen anything. No, I mean, like, like the good nah. shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck the social no, security. No, this is the first the time shit. in my life I'm like, yo, I, I guess sharing dad is pretty cool. <laughs> Maybe I will give CVS my address. Yeah, fuck it. <laughs> Fam. Wow. When this one hit the streets. So, wait, y'all been on? <laughs> y'all been on? Why do you think his Mall. laptop was full Mall. of fucking 10 we, videos? Jizz. <laughs> <laughs> Maul, we have integrity. We would never, ever. Stoop this low oh, okay. to go look at this revenge porn. Okay, mm. got you. You're right, Roy. Because that's what it is. Where's Lisa Bloom when you need her? <laughs> this is revenge porn. <laughs> Lisa Bloom. Imagine Lisa Bloom and every hey, chick from all Lisa these Bloom. Fans. Go represent all of them. <laughs> <laughs> Little more ready. Go ahead and put your phone out. You ready? You no, ready? You ready to go? <laughs> yo, yo, can we break? Yeah, <laughs> you ready to go? Tell the truth. That's My, a solid. It's a, that, it's that's a, a jewel. No, it's a few. Don't I, be cool. No, no, it's a few. I wouldn't mind looking at. I ain't yeah, I know. It ain't in there. Uh, what's your What's your speed? John Nice. Who's that? <laughs> John Nice. <laughs> Who is that? That's how, that's how Jamaicans say Jesus. <laughs> Jesus is good. <laughs> that's uh, that was Stunner's ex girlfriend or some shit like that. I can't keep up with these people. Uh, oh, she let me talk. So this, this is off. the this is the page. This, this is the hackers page. This wait, time out before you. <laughs> no, it's much more organized in folders than folders. Yeah, 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 nah, it's it's clean. It's clean to a T. Like if uh, okay, whatever so your wait. thing is, like if it's feet, you can go to feet. It's everybody feet. <laughs> wow. It's everybody's feet. But what has been the, the what have the girls been saying? They're acting Damn. like they're acting like Metallica when Napster came. <laughs> 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 they're fucking pissed. <laughs> <laughs> You're supposed to pay for this. Oh what they gonna say? They don't be the brightest. Look at all the na- look at all <laughs> But look at all the dudes though. DM link, bro. <laughs> DM please DM link bro <laughs> Now I'm your bro I know. And I'm only talking about The dumb ones in there Cause some of them do be bright Let me not say that There's some industrious <laughs> Young ladies on there Send it bro Nah I'm more judging <laughs> Big homie <laughs> <laughs> nah, He the big homie now Big homie He's definitely the big homie After you do this 100%. Fam I sent that shit To the group chat and Allegedly I, I, <laughs> I had to read it A few times To make sure this was right <laughs> And then I stayed on <laughs> Been home ever Can't since. W- clear the what? date. Yes, I'm not. Yo, Ian, yo, Ian, cancel everything. Maybe, yeah. t- maybe tomorrow too. <laughs> I almost sent a picture to this bitch that didn't DM back. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, <laughs> came you th- from you. <laughs> <laughs> you threw a dick pic in the request. <laughs> not even the real DM. Nah, just show the jizz. <laughs> I mean, got this from you, stink Holy bitch. Shit. Oh my God. I'm kidding, by the way. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. I would never do that. that that's a, a joke. <laughs> we didn't even look. We didn't even look at this. It we are not like this. Screen no. man, what are you doing? Yo, you ain't been the same since that Sony Orchard meme. <laughs> I saw. Um, I saw one woman that I guess was a part, <clears throat> a part of the leak, say, mm. uh, "This is practically rape." All right. All right. Hold up. All right. I'm not doing this. Come on. <laughs> she got to relax, whoever she is. I mean, if you think about it. I, mean, I see what she was. <laughs> no. It's, it's not. I understand. I know, no, I know, no. I know why she's practically. mad. But no, we're not doing that. She she need to knock it, knock it the fuck off. No, nah, we laughing and shit, but this I'm sure this had to fuck up the hustle for. Some of these chicks were eating. Yeah. They would nah, post their little nah, 100 grand a I'll month. I'll be honest with y'all. Because some of them, when they were like 40 a month, like, yo, man, hold up. Y'all wild, but all right. I can see, I, I can I see have, you getting the 40. I have, a different, <laughs> I have a different perspective of it. I think this was like the promo run. Give them some mm. POV, Rory. This is like, a big state? Because I, I, I don't pay for anything for OnlyFans. I went through that shit, and I was like, I got $12 now. I didn't know this is how you was giving it up. <laughs> it was the promo run. Yeah, yeah it's a mixtape. Yeah, I got five grand <laughs> for you now. It's a free EP. Bro, I said $12. You went to five grand? Yeah. That's like 10 years. Per month? <laughs> no, that's the spend the weekend rate. <laughs> that's when you don't want her to leave. 
<laughs> She's like, I got shit to do. All right, how much you gonna make over there? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you know what's funny? That's why I gotta get some niggas on this podcast so we can open up the, the discussion a little bit. Yeah, for Fam, sure. it's a few niggas. I'll call Rye guy right now. He, <laughs> it's a few dudes saying, <laughs> hey, I'm hey, what you make, what you make tonight? <laughs> No, that's oh, yeah. standard. That's, that's mad standard. That's what are you talking about? Well, yeah. y'all always get silent when and when I bring these things up. No, that's no, that's, that's always that's all right. old shit. <laughs> that's what? That's old shit. Girls talk about that. All right, so what's the new shit? I'm at, I'm dated. Oh, I don't know what the new shit is. But that's old though. Like niggas are like, yo, how much you was gonna make tonight? Don't worry about it. Call out. Yeah. Niggas been doing that for years. But that's why you gotta have a lot a of nice mo- a lot of money to fly those type of chicks it's out. A nice move. Because you gotta fly them out, well, put them up, how much and also cover what they <laughs> what they <laughs> making. And you gotta and you gotta research. Yeah. Because they'll uh, pump that number up a little bit. Yeah, they're gonna put it. Actually. And yeah. yo, and they'll yeah. and they'll come yeah. to cut it out. Nah, I'd be offended. They'll come to the city and then work. <laughs> Still work. <laughs> Wait, like I covered. Yeah. I covered what. Yeah, yeah. When you left North Carolina, what you was gonna make? Mm-mm. Why you came to New York? Double bag <laughs> and went to Sapphires to work. Two bags. Yeah, don't, don't get me started, Rory. Don't get me started. We're talking right now. This was the fee for you to not work. <laughs> now you, now you get money. You're supposed to cover all of that. That was to hang out. This one chick tried to apply the weekend, the the, the weekend fee, to just I'm gonna stop by before work fee. I was like, huh? Where'd you get that? Where'd you, how'd you do that? She's just like. Oh, I think I start doing the, math. I would love to see the <laughs> negotiation <laughs> process. Oh, it's great! Oh, it's great! Oh, it's great! <laughs> the haggling. Do I say, well, well, how'd you how'd you come up with that? <laughs> <laughs> well, I gotta call you in. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh no! Shut up, Park. Oh no! I just assumed it would be the same like before. Oh nah. no! No, <laughs> no, it's not. You ever seen a? Uh, you ever seen? Give me a kill. So many years ago. So many years ago. So course, many no, years ago. Is man. So many years ago. Wow, man! Shocked I even remember it. That's They'll like, give you the uh, kill fee. The hmm? kill fee. <laughs> they'll, they'll hit you. I need something. Uh, yeah, the kill fee. The kill fee. Like if you if you pull out, not well, that way. I know. Yeah. yeah. If you back out like of a, the like arrangement, a venue, if you don't go, they give you a kill fee. Oh no, no, I ain't backing out the arrangement now. <laughs> well, once I'm in, I'm in. Oh, you're just gonna haggle until she gets the rate down, right? But I don't get me started, man. Because I'll pay for just some company. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I ain't mad at it, bro. I'll, I'll, I'll pay for you to just come sit on the couch and have a beer. That's sick. <laughs> Joe, Joe just wants a sexy therapist. That's all he wants. That's it. <laughs> That's it. With an accent. Yeah. <laughs> so he can keep asking me what it's, you say? And some, and some daddy issues. What you say? <laughs> no, actually, quite the opposite. I do want a sexy therapist like that knows her dad. Good luck. <laughs> Like, stop making me your dad. <laughs> Imagine your therapist making you dad. <laughs> just... The therapist fucked me up one day with that whole... Oh, shit. Hey, Savon, pass that spray. Uh... Right. That's a good break. Hey, that's a good time for a commercial break. <laughs> no, just you one. Because you be clearing know, the room I know, out. I know. Hey, catch that. <laughs> that's, that's your segue out. <laughs> And we're back with State of the Culture. <laughs> Joe just blows up the set every week. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Robert. You know what? I'm laughing because, and I shouldn't say this, but <laughs> pardon me, I will. <laughs> That's kind of like your whole career. <laughs> yeah. I can't believe Maul told me not to put out OLS3. I, I, before we got this story... You know, you never say that part. Like the biggest record of my career. <laughs> but once, yeah, but once I found out the whole story, I was like, "Oh hell yeah, put that shit out." I thought you was just being spiteful at first. That's a joke, by the way. Listen, <sighs> listen, this is why being single is dope. Ready? Here we go. Because you can just lose the argument. Yeah. <laughs> Who gives a fuck? Like that's a fact. I don't have to win this. No. Just bow out gracefully. You can be listen. right. I don't give a fuck about you. That's a fact. This could end now. Matter of fact, I'm glad you did this. Yeah, you be waiting for the argument. Sometimes I, I, sometimes I wait for you to go ahead and get bold. <laughs> you, don't have, you don't have to respond. Yeah. This isn't going to work. Yeah. No. Yo, once you meet a chick that you could just not respond to, boy, you understand why chicks don't be responding to. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's freeing. It's, it does. It feels good. Yeah, it does. It feels like sit there. <laughs> no, but it's funny. Just, it's, it's funny when right you realize think a, chick, about me. a chick hit you with one of your moves. 
That's when shit is funny. Like, and it, it'll hit you like days later. You're like, wait a minute. I taught you that. <laughs> Hold up. I know she didn't curve me like that. Like, that's my move. You can't use my and move. Then, and then she tweets, oh, you're mad I pulled a U on you? Right. And it's like, all right, how many, how many times are you going to tweet moves, this? Though. Yeah, but yeah. get your own moves is my only thing. I hate when the girls come up with something they think is phenomenal. Get your own moves. They start talking like us. They hate they, when they you, use our they use our vocabulary. They hate when you put a U on you. Shut up. No, I don't. <laughs> Taught you that for a reason, Sensei. <laughs> <laughs> come on, Daniel, son. I'm, I've been teaching you this shit. I taught you that for a reason. <laughs> yeah. Go do that to homeboy so he can toss you back to me. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Shit. Wax on, wax off. That's me. Uh, <laughs> all right, man. So party next door. Wait, hold up. Nah, fuck Smash that. Smash single. <laughs> fuck party mobile. Four minutes. Four party minute anyway, because I am waiting to hear it. Uh, what's your? That's gonna be the greatest car test ever. <laughs> party mobile. Party mobile. <laughs> Elliot, you the man if you get in party's car. <laughs> in his mobile. I, I'm giving it up. If you get in the party mobile, you get the talk. <laughs> the talk title. Yeah, he wins. <laughs> Just there being a talk title was funny. Speaking of talk title, did y'all see, and I had another point to get to, but fuck it, we just rambling because it's Saturday. Did y'all see Peter Davidson, Pete Davidson and Charlemagne's talk? I watched the whole thing. No, I missed it. All right, what did you think of the the, uh, job that the scout locator did? (laughs) I know what you're saying. He ain't shit. He ain't shit. Where were they was at? All right, forget it then. I'm asking a serious question. Oh, I didn't even peep the logo. It's his face in the world because it's see the God world. I didn't even, yo, I didn't even yo, do the knowledge on the do, logo. Do y'all see that plant? <laughs> <laughs> Tell the truth, somebody. Come on. You, you know, don't like the, the glare plant? on his, on his Nick shirt? Holy shit. <laughs> I didn't even peep the glare on the Nick shirt. He's like a superhero. <laughs> yo. Because he's shedding light. So, mm. <laughs> The shedder. <laughs> <laughs> they matched. <laughs> Yo, Charlamagne, you are getting way too much money for this bullshit. I enjoyed the interview. Look at those windows. I didn't see it. I was glued to the the, the background. It's hard to miss. Man, Charlamagne don't even hang out in places with those windows. Where are they? <laughs> <laughs> Empty apartment. We're All right. Airbnb. All right, I'm done with this. I'm back to my question I was about to ask y'all earlier. What's you're, your, you're, not, you're not feeling the fern? That's the not even fern. a fern. <laughs> Oh, Rory Charlemagne got you out of here, though. He got the new Rock Nation hat. You don't. Oh, shit. Mm, his plane got colors. <laughs> <laughs> Yours just white. Coincidence? Mm. <laughs> See what you did there. Yo, what's the longest you'll wait for a girl? All girls are late. What's the longest you wait? Like if we meet in somewhere, you mean? Or if she's coming to your house. Uh, <laughs> how bad do I want to be? Yeah, how she look? She looks great. Wait, I'm at my house, I got too? time. Yeah, in your home. Got nothing but time. Been, been there anyway. Wait, <laughs> if I'm home, it doesn't matter. Like if I'm at dinner, yeah. she's running late. Do y'all have a threshold anywhere? <laughs> if I'm in the crib, I got all night. Yeah. I'm not going nowhere. What if you're sleepy? Uh, when, I, when she calls, I'll, I'll answer. If you make plans with a chick and she's coming to your house and I, she's supposed to be there at 11 mm-hmm. and at 2, she's texting like, yo, my bad, <laughs> still running around, but I'm coming. Mm-hmm. You just going to be, be up waiting? No, I'm gonna be in the crib chilling, doing whatever I'm doing. Are you? you There's no such thing as I'm up chilling at three thirty now. No, you're not. Sure, there is. What? I'm always up at three thirty watching TV. We still, we still counting the tips. Yeah, I thought you meant like if I'm at 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 a restaurant and she she's running late, I'll leave after. So I'm like, I'm out of here. But if I'm home, you won't leave home. No, I plan (laughs) on being here all night. Will you eat at the restaurant? No, personally. So you don't really. Why not? What if you wanted to eat there? So you don't really have a problem being the, the second date dude. Like she could go see dude and then just come see you after. Oh, no, God. no problem with that. No, right? Not, not, not wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. To find that, to find that, to find that. Because I might be okay just, with that. Just, just that nah. fast. We not up chilling at three, three thirty in the house <laughs> no, anymore. I'm still up at three thirty, but I'm, but now she can't would, come. Uh, now now she she's can. with a dude and they come here. No, but you wouldn't know more, and that's just no, why I keep. Okay, I wouldn't know, but I'm just saying if I do know, am I cool with that? She just go on a date and then come to your crib to fuck. You not doing that. You guys are men. We got that. What she I'm eat? saying if you, if I'm a girl, <laughs> which let, eat? was there a lot of garlic involved? Fair, let him feed you. Oh, he fell. Oh, you're right. that guy. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. You coming to the crib oh to my beat? God, we've all been that guy before, though. Don't think that you've ever took a chick out to eat and then didn't beat and she went and somewhere. She's, oh, and she oh, definitely it's, went it's to, it's to every man. Been cool. smashing her. More. 
I wasn't always trying to beat after an outing. I'm just no, I'm not saying you were. I'm saying we've always we've all been in that position right, where we've been out with a girl, mm -hmm. had a good night. Oh, and then she left to go get her brakes <laughs> brakes yeah. beat off by yeah. another dude. Yeah, one thousand yeah. percent that's happened. Yeah, you've but been on both. He, 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 probably didn't know. he probably didn't know she was out with a dude, but we've well, all been in that. Situation. Well, that's why. Listen, you just took major. I've been in the situation. Wait, wait, hold, up before, on date. hold up before I forget this point because you just took major offense to being the second date dude, but. Would you rather be that first date dude in the scenario you just brought up? Which dude would you rather be? No, nah, give me the second date. Give me the buns. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. If you want to go out on a fancy a dinner with dude and yeah, then, don't give me the and bill. then give immediately me the leave to my crib. <laughs> yeah, where, don't give me the bill. Give me the buns. Where I'm oh, chilling. Oh, oh. Yeah, I'll Ball's take the for buns over, buns Ball over for bills. mayor. Yeah. <laughs> buns Ball's over bills. definitely an alderman. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> buns over bills for sure. Uh, okay, but now she goes out with the first dude. Mm-hmm. She's not fucking him, so she's just gonna milk him for the drinks. Yeah, you got it. Right. Time. Now, by the time she gets to you, she can't stand up. She's super drunk. You maybe to get drunk buns. You taking that? Drunk buns? I'm not big on two drunk buns. Two drunk buns. Two drunk buns. No, 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 no that's not fun. No, thanks. That's not fun. Never that's not good. a fun. That's not a fun. Never. What, what do white boys say? It's not a fun lay. Yeah, no. no. Fun lay. <laughs> two drunk buns is disgusting. Yeah, two drunk is never good. Hangover buns, like on a 10 a.m. wake up. Let's take that. Yeah, that's you know I'm nasty. I like a little hangover breath on you. Yeah, a little yeah, hangover, hangover sex is oh top, no, but no, top but tier the breath, sex. I want to smell. I want to smell. No, when you're hungover, I just beat from the side. When you're both hungover, too, yeah, yeah. then you just go back to bed afterwards. That's, just beat from the side. That's when you just beat from the side. Yeah. Now then, she got to go take her and daughter to school. And I can't feel anything on my body. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm gonna stay in bed. You go take your daughter to school. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> grab me a water. <laughs> that's I like. See, that's the small gesture I appreciate. Yeah, the water. Yeah, yeah. Like when she go get the water. When she go get the rag. Yeah. I expect you to go get the rag. Yeah. I just put it down. <laughs> like, if I like you, you should, I expect you to get the rag. If I don't like you, I'm jumping out. Hey, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> whoa, that was crazy. <laughs> damn, your Uber just showed up that damn, quick. Damn, man. Damn, man. Oh. Damn, Surprised one, we even stayed up this yeah. late. <laughs> one minute away. I got to work they're, early. <laughs> they're quick over here with the Ubers. <laughs> yeah. Rory has a whole list of music that came out in his phone. <laughs> and he started this podcast by saying, oh, remember when we used to be a music podcast? Rory, hit it. <laughs> so yesterday, I was caught on a, a third wheel date in the middle of a debate. Oh, yeah. Ooh. I wanted to talk about this. Oh, this is the date no, podcast now. It is. <laughs> Fuck it. Um, so they, these two people. Uh, so let me get a water, please. Is that, is that what they call it? Um, no, I want a water. Okay. See. <laughs> These two people are on a date um, and they were arguing on the first date. Yeah, that not I Poland to be Spring. On. Sewer water. Peasant water. Look how rich you are. Maul taught me that. <laughs> Maul is rich. Good pH. Good pH in that water. Yeah, you got your pH is balanced. Maul is rich. Very important. All right, you were on a third date. Give it to me. I was on the date. Last and lap. They, um, what happened? Yes, you you were the third lap. wheel. I was the third wheel on the date. Gotcha. <laughs> anything to get away from the house. Yo, when <laughs> niggas is married, they will do anything to third get away. Third wheel? Sure. That yeah. sounds great. <laughs> oh, go out with you and this girl. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. What? Fuck it. Of course. No, I'll pay. <laughs> <laughs> let me take y'all to my favorite spot. <laughs> yeah. Let me take y'all two out. Let me, get to, let me get to know y'all. The date guide. <laughs> so they started the first date off beefing off rip because. that was Wait. You say it was their first date? It was their first date. Oh shit! So why would yeah. you bring a third Cause, wheel cause on the first date? Because he brought his man's date? with him <laughs> on yes. the first date. That's yes. sick. So wait, who did you know? The guy or the girl? The guy. Okay. No, I didn't go with a girl on her first date to meet some dude. I gotta ask. I gotta no, ask. You don't. I gotta ask. Because I wouldn't do that. Yeah. I gotta ask. I'm Maul, offended right Maul now. Maul thinks you are classless scum. No, you gotta ask. I have to ask. But, why, but finish it. Just so I have, I, yo, I have to ask because I why? believe you to be classless scum. No, no, no. Scum. I have to ask because I need to know what type of relationship you have and what friends. Or you can say it that way. Yeah. It was one of my extremely close male friends. Got you. Okay, keep, proceed. He said... Yo, oh, like, like Rex and Duke. <laughs> Precisely. We took our own shots. That was shots. probably their first date, yeah. too. Yeah, that was their first date. <laughs> That's second date, Joe. That, they, Who do you they, think we are? They was third wheeling. <laughs> no, she was the third wheel. <laughs> come on with your fucking synopsis. <laughs> so, uh, she started beefing when she come in. The moment she walked in, she was like, all right, so you just sent me the address and told me to meet you here. I expected and thought that you were going to send me an Uber to the spot. And he went, we live in New York. Just meet me there. I'm not sending you a car. I don't even know you. 
Which confirms Maul's theory that you are classless scum. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to point that out. Joe, I was that's crazy I just happened to, to be there. <laughs> no, that's not it ain't Rory's fault. <laughs> I that just wasn't happened his to day. be there. No, I'm judging Rory for knowing somebody who, oh, okay. who Got you. deals that way. Got you. Okay. No, no, that's my dude. Association brings on affiliation. Okay, here, all right. Well, here's the thing. He might have been all right. I agreed with him. Yeah. We live in New York City. You live on 59th Street. Oh, no, you don't need Fam, a cab. I'll meet you there. First of yeah. all, that's a lie. Anybody that Rory and the homeboy was talking to is from Brooklyn. And on 59th Street. <laughs> that's not fair. Brooklyn 59th is, Street in Brooklyn. Brooklyn is big. Okay, by oh, okay. the way. <laughs> there we go. By the way, when she did walk in, I did assume she was a Brooklyn chick. And then she said, I live on 59th and 9th. I was like, let me see your license. <laughs> so your man could have Ubered her there. No. Nah. I think, I think oh, no, it, listen, I, I'll Uber you back. I think that was my compromise in the middle of the third wheel debate. Smart move. I will Uber them. you back to make sure you're, you're home safely after we have met. Mm-hmm. If we met on Instagram and I don't know you, I'm probably not going to Uber you. And you shouldn't even tell me your address. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. I could feel that. Just meet me at the spot. I could feel yeah. that. If if I tell a chick to meet me at the spot, I'm never trying to fuck her. <laughs> well, you probably can't. I don't know how meet famous this gentleman f- was, but as a famous person, you probably can't be like, yo, yeah. I'll, I'll see you there. Because they'll screenshot a- <laughs> yeah. Yeah. and send it to the shade. As an unfamous dude, I just felt like if you were the person asking for the date. You've been a famous dude since you were like 17. Wait, so they they met on Instagram. They met on Instagram. <laughs> oh, they had, they, had never, ne- they had never met before. This was the first like... First one, so it, was yeah. like a, it was like almost a blind date because you didn't know if it was gonna be catfish. Oh, yeah, you saw the pictures. I mean, everything these days is a blind date. Yeah, you, you didn't know, know what it was they look catfish. Like. Yeah, um, got you. So yeah, I, I was with him. I'm not Ubering you. I don't even know you. You don't even know me. Yeah. I'll meet you there. Yeah, <laughs> blind date. Did she know you were gonna be there? Uh, yes, because to get in, you need to be a member, and he was not a member. Oh, got you. Okay. Oh, we're getting more. We're getting more. Dude, that's, that's, kind of, that's, that's, that's an interesting that's, twist. That's a really important part. Yo, Rory, I'm trying to take this chick out. That's a good spot, though, because it's almost like you don't have to be with him. <laughs> All right, I'm on this girl's side. <laughs> <laughs> you, you and your man are creeps. And don't ever invite me out again. No, I'm assuming y'all no, no. was at Soho. It was at Soho, yeah. So that's, that's no, no, a big spot. We weren't planning on going. We were Ball. at an event across the street, and it ended. So we was like, all right, let's go to Soho House. Yeah, see? It's not the same. Soho House is big. You don't have to be bothered. And by the way, nah, I'm using, I'm using so date weird. real loosely, too. Because I could be at the bar. I could be at a table. Now, if I got to use my man shit to get the he, first date off. Did. That's not what he did. That's not what he did. Okay. He happened to go. It was my idea after the event ended. He was like, yo, I got to meet this chick. I said, well, I'm going to Soho House. He said, all right, I'll go there. I'll tell him to meet us there. That's not bad. Oh, It's a big spot. It's like a bar. So they didn't have the first date planned. No. That's why I said date was loose. Okay. Right. I would just kind of do yeah, this see, more for conversation. Oh, this, this, we, we this going changes here, everything. Tell us here. Yeah, tell us meet us here. This changes Forget everything. It. He it. should absolutely not have Ubered her. Of course no, not. No, no, no. That's what I'm rolling. That's not, a, that's not an official Columbus first Circle. date even. It's every train ever. Yeah. <laughs> and it's yellow cabs everywhere on 59th. Yeah. yeah. That's like a $10 cab. It's not even, it's not um, even a thing. Wait, right, Soho, so, Brooklyn? No, 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 no. The Soho house. Okay, okay so now what happens, and I want to get off this because I don't feel like this is so compelling, but but what happens when now I'm the girl, I had a great time with homeboy, and now I want to go back. <laughs> go to, home? To her home? No, I want to go back to where you took me to on our first date. Oh. <laughs> that's, <laughs> a good, that's a very good point. It's quiet. That's why you can't and do that. And that's the... why I wouldn't do that. No, yeah. it's quiet. It's quiet. Because now I'm calling Rory again? <laughs> you okay, borrow your car again? Uh, and once she finds out my, that my, Rory's my, the connect, she's going to fuck Rory. No, that's why my, my friend would say, "Yo, that wasn't my membership. We not going there." Yeah. So no, I, I don't think that's a thing. Your friend wouldn't say very much after that because she's boogieing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hope he got it all out. I Yo, we're not guys, going back to Soul House. You guys uh, are giving. Okay, I'll, I'll go with Lance Stevenson. <laughs> that's a sick. What the fuck are you talking about? That's a sick nigga to throw out there like that's that. I'm just saying. All right, I'll go with Lance. Uh-huh. Yo, you are giving Soul House a lot of credit on getting cheeks. Why is that? What do you mean? That, don't think it's a, that she would have beat, know. but then she found about. out he wasn't a member and was like, nah. <laughs> Come on. I, th- I think women can be very fickle that way. I agree, but not in that situation. Shit, some girls. You're, you're taking your chick who's wearing <laughs> cement sevens? <laughs> I'm just so cement sevens. <laughs> and you think that that's the girl that's like... <laughs> Yes, actually, I do. Yeah, Joe's got a good point. Fam, you taking Very a point. chick with your Jordan 1s <laughs> to Soul House on your man? No, 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 no. Facts. No, no, that's bad. That's bad. That's bad. And I ain't no date con. I ain't Hitch. <laughs> All my dates is, yo, come through. <laughs> yeah. 
No, but yeah. that's a good first. That's date. a great date. It's not even. I wouldn't even consider that a date. The crib. Like, the crib date is the best. Yeah, date. It, 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 it technically house, wasn't a date. Yeah. Establish. I'm not a girls ain't doing attacker no and then come through. They are on the first. Oh, I'm glad I got out on the first date. Well, that's why you got to go to her bar first. <laughs> Rim. <laughs> Rim. <laughs> What? That's not the, going to a bar is not <laughs> you, the first date. You, yes, it is. <laughs> no, if, are you dressed to the nines? <laughs> no, <laughs> definitely not dressed to the nines. <laughs> Do you have on your cement sevens? <laughs> <laughs> dressed to the nines. All right, forget it then. <laughs> no, but going to the crib, girls ain't doing that no more. I'm Which is smart. They, they should and safe they not of them to not do. You gotta have some type <laughs> no, of. No, well, shut up. They do mad unsafe shit though. They replace it with They man. do They fly to another country with yeah. <laughs> They, they yeah. never met that's Yeah that's crazy That's a fact <laughs> With no clothes No wallet <laughs> No phone That'd be my problem Oh no we talked about this already <laughs> oh Chicks that won't it. go to the crib On a first date Be like nah First date gotta be a vacation Alright <laughs> So you wanna go to a remote island With me instead <laughs> Where people can't hear your screams you go to the jungle Okay <laughs> I'll bury you there <laughs> I'm shutting up, man. So, so party's yeah, some, single. Some of the chicks, the, the thinking is just flawed a little bit. That's all. Just a little bit. Chicks put themselves in mad compromising situations. Often. Yeah. <laughs> thank God we're and such they, good they, guys. And they think because their homegirl has their location that they're safe. No, you can be dead still. <laughs> <laughs> your, phone Yo. is, your phone is still going to be on. <laughs> I, no, I just, on Sunday, just had that conversation. I said, all right. All right oh, so we know where the body is. <laughs> uh, or we know where the phone is. Yeah, or the phone. And what is your big bad 90 pound girlfriend gonna do if you have the location? Yeah. What is Jacinta gonna do? <laughs> Honestly. What is India Love gonna do? <laughs> Y'all are sick. Mo, I can't think, believe you think India Love is so sexy. India Love is sexy. She is. I don't see how y'all don't think so. Because sexy and attractive aren't the same to me. She's both. Definitively, huh? Or every guy has to think that. No, I'm not. No. I see some guys think girls are sexy that I'm like, I don't see it, but okay. But India Love, I think, is a unanimous sexy, though. Unanimous meaning every guy has to think that. Not every guy, but most guys would think she's sexy. Okay. Yeah. Even after the fist video? Yeah, that, that did nothing. That didn't, that didn't slow that ship down at all. No, they, they was just looking for a park. For real? Yeah, that sexy ship kept <laughs> that sexy ship kept going full steam ahead. So, oh, that's that's what gets it done. <laughs> yeah. Park date, okay. I got a blanket. Yeah, mad parks. Yo, I see why y'all <laughs> chicks wear Jordan one. <laughs> mad parks. It's mad parks yo, in New York. Yo, yo, this is craziness over yeah. here. <laughs> oh shit! You think girls in heels wouldn't let you fist them? It's a park? Oh, listen. Oh, okay. Listen. I was about to tell you. Listen. I know a few. <laughs> Little buddy. Matter of fact, I think buddy. the chick with the ones might have some better standards. I'm trying to tell you. Nah, nah. Chicks, chicks who fuck better? Sneakers. Yeah. No way. More athletic. No way on God's green earth. They are not athletic. athletic. Does the Jordan 1 <laughs> yeah, chick more athletic. beat the chick that's been city hopping and all-star weekend hopping in heel? Nah, because nah. the chick with sneakers got something to prove. Chick First of all, chick with I red bottom it, is just girl, getting paid. Now nah, the girl with the, the nice shoes might be more athletic than the girl in the Jordans because them shits you, you can't walk around in them yeah. shits. Yeah, yeah but that, that, I, that's, I, I, that's I, hard. The girl with the that's heels her feet hurt by the time she gets to you. Good, that's where the massage coming at. The massage. Mm. You still getting that move off? <laughs> Any nigga that a foot massage. Mas- you not taking the Jordans off? Only a <laughs> massage. Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Ma. Hey, that, if you stop dating bitches in Jordan ones, they'll need a massage too. You like, damn, why your feet are in always such good shape? Yeah, yeah nice feet. Yo, Ooh. I cannot believe y'all are still. Rory they're, they're is the only one here that can do that because he's twenty nine. Why? Do I got? I got what? Three months left? <laughs> yeah. Now nah, you can do it. You can pull it off to a little 30, bit into thirty two. It's little all bit hypothetical, 33. of course. Obviously, we're joking. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not joking. Don't bring no bitch around me in Jordan 1. Talking about, hey, this is such and such. I'll tell. <laughs> I'll tell. I, I, will, I will tell. I swear to God. Yo, your man is over here. <laughs> he is fucking wild. I'll tell. Yeah, I'm, I'm telling. Don't bring nobody around me. Oh, man. All right. Rory, what other albums came out or what other songs came out? This podcast is over. <laughs> we ain't said a, a thing yet. We didn't even get to our FaceTime conversation. <laughs> oh, shit. I wanted to hit that one too. Finish the music. Come on, Terrence Howard, D Block. I mean, D Boy. Who else came out? Terrence Howard. 
I didn't hear uh, shit. K-pop. Uh, let's see. Uh, Jada announced. Let's uh, see. I thought March, Jada was supposed to drop uh, this now March, you March add, Now you want to state the culture. Look, <laughs> <laughs> Jada announced this recently. I got the news from State of the Culture. <laughs> uh, Smoke Dizzy put out some. He did. That's no problem. I knew Parks was about to jump out the window. <laughs> I went to the listening session. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> what did I see? Why we gonna get you a chick with some heels? <laughs> hey, ma. Want to come with me to the smoke dizzle <laughs> listening session? <laughs> no, nigga. <laughs> Fair, I'm not bringing a chick to the dizzle listening session. <laughs> nah, I see why, y'all. Why not? Lori in the Griselda show. She probably can't wear heels to the Griselda show. <laughs> she can. All right. All right. I see what's going on. Though, by the way, there were some chicks in there. I know. Yeah. What, what were they wearing? Jordans. Yeah, I'm sorry, smoke dizzle. Nah, they was in there. Y'all crazy. <laughs> yeah, well, pay them no mind. Uh, <laughs> it's cool. We hear more. We hear. <laughs> uh, Pink Sweats put out a uh, a single. Uh, YF and Lucci put out an album. <laughs> Little Baby put out an album. The chicken Jordan one still pay for our own weed. <laughs> nah, she she fucked the weed dude and get it for free. <laughs> nah, nah, he's charging her. <laughs> my bitch in the hills, my can't. bitch in the hills is getting Yo, it on believe, the arm. I can't believe you killing chicks that wear sneakers. I can't yeah, believe nuts. that y'all. No, uh, no, 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 no. Not, Not chicks that wear sneakers. <laughs> Sneakerhead chicks. It's a difference. What does she work at? Complex. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, I mean, wish I wouldn't be trying to fuck you about yo complex con is next month. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get there bitch, early for I the new release. What, yo, you seen Joe Lapuma new shit? No, bitch. You seen Joe <laughs> <laughs> what are you? What are you saying to me? <laughs> yo, go ahead, man. Just report the news, man. What, what smoke did it did? <laughs> Put out a project. All right, there we go. Let's, let's break it down. Yeah, let's break it down. It's a nice project. <laughs> that's, yo, the yo. that's the breakdown. That's the breakdown. Yo, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, you seen little baby on sneaker shopping? <laughs> he copped all the fire yo, shit. <laughs> yo, he, he dropped twenty on kicks. <laughs> like, <laughs> what's some shit's called when you wait online to buy the shoes? Camping, yeah, raffle, camping, the raffle, the raffle, <laughs> shooting the raffle. Yeah, y'all, y'all shooting your shout out with bitches on nah. the raffle line. <laughs> no, you are, yo, I'm you my age, no, 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 I'm not talking like that. But I'm you are about, almost my age. No, but I'm talking about the girls that just all the fly sneakers that they, they got them. Like that That's a stylish chick Like she could wear sneakers She could wear heels Like I'm not talking about the girl That s- sleeps outside of <laughs> House of Hoops To get the new LeBrons No Outside of Chips That's, no, I'm t- no, I'm that's t- a sneaker head bitch, That though. is too But that's not the one I'm talking about I'm talking about the one That just know the fly sneakers And she got them And she know what to wear with them Like she's stylish Joe, Joe, we're, yeah, not, we're not talking about the Supreme collab box. That's <laughs> not what we talking about. Yeah, no, nah, we're talking about just the girls that know how to put yeah. a pair they of put an outfit on. together. Yo, that's the bitch that come to your cruiser. You got candy. <laughs> yeah. See? <laughs> I cannot See, believe you. I'm out. And, I'm setting up for the rest. And, you got candy, no, you bitch. Can, and, and I am I an can. adult. Would you like dinner? <laughs> like, would you like leftovers? You oh. fucking heathen, bitch. They, they don't, <laughs> they don't would, have you, ch- would you like some water? <laughs> I don't have sour powers, bitch. <laughs> they don't have chicken fingers that catch steak? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Hey, maybe I'm a Republican. Maybe I'm a Republican. Maybe this is classic. That's not who I was talking about, bro. <laughs> All right. That's not the type of girls I was talking about, but okay. Yo. That's definitely not the She type don't of know, girl. though. I could skip the line at Kith. I could yeah. get her whatever. <laughs> Do you got candy? <laughs> Bitch, you have to leave. Holy fuck. <laughs> Uh-huh. All right. Can can your chef make chicken Alfredo? <laughs> they love chicken Alfredo. <laughs> they love chicken Alfredo. It's true. <laughs> Me too, though. No. <laughs> Me too. Though. I kind of hate that chicken Alfredo gets a bad rap now. Nah, chicken nah, Alfredo's chicken, delicious. Chicken Alfredo with the shit. It yeah. is. All right, man. New music. <sighs> this album's great. <laughs> <laughs> This album is really good. <laughs> is it? It is good. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I enjoy uh, it a lot. Shout Joe, you, you put me on to the Janae single being a Lucy from 10 years ago. <laughs> yeah, I don't. Listen, Janae put out a song called Happiness Over Everything. In the video. In parentheses, it said Ho, featuring Future and Miguel. Mm-hmm. Um, so I purchased it because I purchased everything that because Janae Sean does. Because Sean put the pressure on you. Oh, I purchased everything that Janae does except for... Calm down. No, you said you purchased that. Calm 
I deleted it. <laughs> I did buy that actually. <laughs> um, I deleted it though. So she put out the song, and the song sounds great. Yeah, it's like a great it. song. It's just a new version of a song she already put out. See, I didn't called know. Ho, featuring Miguel. Okay. Oh. Was it a leak or she put it out? No, this was out. <laughs> like on iTunes or like a SoundCloud. <laughs> Well, she also put out that New Balance record and then put it on the album with some more sauce on it. Like oh, she's, that's she's done that People before. do that all the yeah. time. But to like, do a single twice is... Well, I just love that the only ordinary. Janae, if yeah. she's going to have to make the whole song, would take it from a Love Below Andre 3000 skit as the hook. That's the Where Are My Panties interlude. Yeah, this is on her oh. album. And they just sing it. Classic project. Oh, it's from the, the first first joint. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I stand corrected. You know this song, right? I do, yeah. No, I know this was bef- <coughs> before Janae even popped. Uh, this was like from the album that had July with Drake. Mm-hmm. Okay. Computer doing what it wants. Because <laughs> you busted on it too much. I'm going home <laughs> to do the same. <laughs> Uh, what's happening? All right, doesn't want to play anything. That's fine. Well, yeah, I like the record. I like. Yeah, fe- I like future on it. Cool video. I didn't see the vid. Yeah, you're seeing it right now. They're partying. <clears throat> flame, it looks looks like dancers. a place where where hoes that care about their happiness would be. Yeah. So, I'm with it. I like it, Janae. Uh, SZA and Justin keep that same energy. <clears throat> I didn't hear. I wasn't same energy from when? Uh, Meek and Justin. I said I like that song. Yeah, but you threw some, you threw some sauce. <laughs> I said I won't ever go Man back to it. Man on the Woods. That was before he actually heard the song. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Well, I like the record. I, uh, I like the record. It's uh, It feels like a soundtrack record. Like, it is. I, yeah, I know. Okay. But it feels like it. Yeah. Like it, they're, they're using the happy uh, blueprint. Yeah. Disco drums and mm-hmm. all that shit. Yeah. I like it, though. But I like uh, Sad Scissor. I love sad SZA. Yeah, it's the best. Like, I hope she's not sad in life, but make sad music. I told you all, these girls ain't going to know what to do uh, once sexy SZA drops, because she's going to be loving herself and shit. Like, she's going to have confidence. She's in the disco ball Like, suit. the music is going to be different. I love you, SZA. And I can't wait for I your album SZA. to come. New Jersey's finest. I forget that she's from New Jersey. Mm-hmm. Get out of here, Justin. Get away from her. Did, <laughs> did Hype Williams do this, or do they owe him some money? That's a good question. It's <laughs> a good question. It looks like a lot of Justin videos, too. They owe Hype a check. Yeah. Um, Hype, Hype yeah, it was cool. Hype doesn't need it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's chilling. Uh, what else see. came out, Roar? What, did you guys listen to the Lil Baby album? I didn't get a chance. Uh, I listened to three or four songs. It's not really my... Uh, my your, your cup of tea? No, my cup of tea. Yeah, yeah it's not for it. I heard yeah. it. I like it. It's cool. Yeah. I like Lil Baby, though, but I just not my type of music. Uh, G Herbo's album I do want to hear, because I like G Herbo a lot. I heard like four or five songs. It sounded really well, good, actually. It's on your phone. Just check it out when you get a chance. Well, you know, come on, I'm booked and busy. <laughs> <laughs> Terrace Martin put out a project, not oh, did not he? Terrence Howard. Oh, okay. Shout out to Terrace Martin, man. One of the more underrated. Uh, I'll be honest with y'all. Musicians. All of them talk about. Yeah, it. all the talk about co-producers. Was way more fun than this. For sure. Yeah, the whole way talk better. was killing. It was. This it was. Music, we just got to run yeah. through this. Uh, my guy, <laughs> my guy, child put out his album. Hey, it's really, really good. I'm not familiar with him, really. Uh, I've, I've played him on on the pod a couple times. Uh, Synthetic Soul is out now. Well, Rory, give us an unbiased take on how is it? Uh, I'm biased. <laughs> Got it. But Sorry. I do love it. It's, it's it's really dope. Got it. So so check that out. Some good R&B. Yes. Some, what type of R&B is it? Sad R&B or uh, Dylan uh, Drum it's all, R&B? It's alternative, electronic esque. Um, so there's some sad, K- so K- some Trinata. sad shit in there. Some happy shit. It's cool. Just okay. check it out. I will. How's that for a pitch? Just check it out. <laughs> yeah. Fuck trying to convince you. <laughs> just, just go listen to it, man. Yeah, listen to it. I'll I don't want to be responsible for pitching beautiful music. Like, just go listen to it, man. I feel it. Don't, 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 don't use me. <laughs> yeah. Music lovers depend on music lovers, Rory. That's right. And that's why I'm saying, check it out. And I trust your opinion. Is that all on our music breakdown? I think. DJ Drama put out a single, but I could be wrong. Yeah, I didn't see that one. He's supposed to be putting out a yeah with Westside and um Rick with Ross. <coughs> yeah, that sounds right. Mm-hmm. We're informed. 
Yeah, featuring Lou, Westside Gun, and Rick Ross. Mm-hmm. Intro, DJ Drama. You know it's funny, right? I think I've come to realize I like when they count me out. Wait, what's happening right now? Makes it that much sweeter when I'm counting. We're not listening to it, so I'm, I'm going to do it. Oh, yeah, you should do the verses, too. <laughs> That's how Drama came in. That was Drama's intro. I sounded just like him, right? Makes it that much sweeter when I'm I, counting up. I, I promise you don't have to do this. Is there a reason we're you, not you've never looked at me, You've never looked at me as Mr. Thanksgiving? I'm sorry? <laughs> I'm on the outside of an inside joke. Me too. <laughs> y'all Mr. Not, Thanksgiving? Y'all, y'all not with the culture. Is drama Mr. Thanksgiving? Y- yeah. Oh. You were too busy pumping it up during that era. <laughs> oh, you, oh, my God. <laughs> No, hey. don't even do that because I think Puff gave him that name. I don't care, but I just remembered, and that was I still na- remember. That's nasty. You know, we're not talking about it. Parks, he's Mister Thanksgiving because everybody eats. Hmm. Oh, now y'all get he explained. It. Now y'all get it. See, yeah. look at y'all. Y'all connected. Hundred million streams later, now you understand us, right? <laughs> Actually, they don't understand us still. <laughs> at all. A <laughs> hundred million streams did nothing for them. Did absolutely nothing. <laughs> they still get us wrong. <laughs> Don't know how we feel about things. Huh. Fuck it. Um, no, 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 no. Maul, please put your phone away. Please put your phone away. What? Summer Walker defended. Oh, <laughs> Summer did. Well, she did now. I t- I've been off the grid for two days. I don't know what she did. What happened? What did she do? What um, did she say? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't see this. <laughs> yeah, she trying not to catch the corona. <laughs> Nah, that's right. <laughs> Y'all mad? Right. Y'all mad? No. Nah, that looks, nah. that looks yeah. like safety. Man, Wait, that's all safety. That's all. Yeah. Maul, it's that's dangerous. That Can trash, I tell y'all that something? That trash bag breaks when I put leftover Chinese food in it. Nope. <laughs> Is that stopping the coronavirus? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Is it Lysol? Well, let me just interject and tell you and the rest of the people doing that stupid shit that that is not <laughs> that is not protecting you. From the cor- the it's coronavirus airborne. can indeed penetrate that plastic. It's like it's the reason why I say uh, I don't understand why you guys use condoms. What that's doing <laughs> is protecting you from someone else Got a good who point. may have the virus. Mm-hmm. It it prevents yeah. it from being exchanged that way. Condoms, which is how you catch it, is airborne, right? Uh, I don't know all about it. <laughs> don't, don't get me started. You get scared of the coronavirus. Hmm? Are you scared? I'm gonna cut my beard today. Um, I know y'all are joking, but this is getting real in the streets. Uh, they found their first. They found their first. Uh, you can take a summer off of their screen, man. They found the first person in New York who, uh, who has who tested for the coronavirus who has not went out of town, hasn't had contact with anybody out the country. So, and now there's like twenty more people in New York City. Um. There's a lot. There's a lot going on. Like the stock market is crashing. <laughs> true. So that's when you have to say shit is getting real. Yeah, for sure. Which is why. Which is what I think all of this is really all about, anyway. Well, that's Conspiracy what it's always cast. about. Yeah. Hmm? Conspiracy cast. No, I'd like, I mean, like to see Mueller's conspiracy. Better. I like it too. No, I mean it's that. That doesn't surprise me that the stock market crashed the way it did. Like, well, most of the world. Particularly the U.S. depends on Chinese economy. So if there's a big epidemic in China, even if it's not a big epidemic, that's why the stock market is crashing. It makes sense. I'm not particularly scared of getting the coronavirus. Knock on wood, though. Just for safety. Yeah, just wash your hands, man. And if the world was round, it wouldn't crash. And be black. So if you think about it. Yeah. Be black and wash your hands. Yeah. Melanin. Yeah. That's pretty cool. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> <laughs> Alright so that's I tell you always finds a way to when I, Right when I think I got him on the ropes With this summer shit <laughs> <laughs> Finds a way to with, I Okay okay, Maul Do you think the Summer Walker and Chris Brown Record is working? I love that song I do too I really love it The one they put out A couple months ago? Mm-hmm. Yeah that record is hard I love that song No no is it working? I love it When you say working What do you mean? I just don't hear it out I'm sure Justice could Stat me to death I'm sure it's doing fine Streaming but I don't. Think, I just don't hear it the, the way I thought I was going to hear that record. I don't, I don't. Okay, I'm with you on that. But I don't think that Chris Brown or Summer need a record to work. Whenever they put their projects out, it's going to do well. Do you think that's R&B? not my point? It's, it, that record should work. Like on it paper, should, it's you, a, such a working record. Yeah, but where would it work at? Like, 
I don't even understand what work means anymore. Like when you're an established artist and you're successful as Summer has been, when she didn't even want to tour and she sold out every venue, it's like she, I'm sure when she puts her project out, it's gonna be successful. I don't doubt that. So it's a different era. Like you don't need Chris Brown. Chris Brown definitely doesn't need a record to work. Like as soon as he puts his project out, it's gonna stream well. Someone puts a project out, it's gonna stream well. For new acts, it's different. They need a record to work. Summer Walker doesn't need that. Shut you down. So Love I'm, the record. I'm, though. I'm speechless. Great record. <laughs> I thought I thought I would hear it more, but no. All right. I'm so mad I didn't go to fucking Trinidad for Carnival. <clears throat> yeah, I thought you were gonna go. I thought you were gonna speak to the kids with Nikki. I was gonna go, but it was just too last minute. I thought we were going to go to New Orleans, too, but... I thought we were going to get watches. <laughs> Damn, who's Bria? <laughs> Wait, is she in that, is she in that, that terabyte? <laughs> why, she, why is she up there? Hey, I'm trying to leave now. <laughs> hey, hey, let's go, let's go. Oh, I can't find it, huh? Yeah. Can't find Bria anymore? What do you don't say? <laughs> Oh no wait, you're not gonna put it back for real? <laughs> you said no? Yeah, ah, okay. There you go. What's that ad name? You ain't she follow you back screaming? Yes. <laughs> she know you lost to Wyclef in a rap battle yesterday? <laughs> oh, I I love curls too. Hold up. <laughs> <laughs> is she forever curly? <laughs> it worked. I've been looking for a chick whose curls was gonna stay forever. <laughs> Yo. See, Mo, this is one of those instances. He didn't want to show us Brie again. Uh, no. Is Brie wearing sneakers? <laughs> mm. Appears. Man. Those are Air Force ones. <laughs> what is it, Brie 3? <laughs> oh, got it. <laughs> Joe's a creep. What do you mean, Joe? Mo? Mo? Look at Mo. <laughs> I'm not, nah, I'm not even looking. I'm not following that girl, man. <laughs> not me neither. I'm not following. <laughs> With an I. <eye. laughs> is the is the E a three? <laughs> oh, she looked like one. Of, <laughs> like somebody has got Long Island in a muck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, listen. Uh, Rory's gonna look for some more music that came out. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not. I have a. Over a hundred sports question for you guys that, I, that I've been meaning to come in here for the past two weeks and ask, but I've been sidetracked. Uh, baseball season starts t- soon. Mm-hmm. The Houston Astros are now angry at the league Why? Cause they- for being angry at them because they cheated. In preseason, the Astros pitchers, I mean, the Astros hitters have been Pitched at like six out of the eight games they play. First of all, being thrown at in a preseason game period is crazy. Yeah, y'all, not, up. y'all not understanding what's going on. And first, let me start by saying that's one thing that I, that baseball and hockey y'all win there, man. Y'all can really kill somebody with y'all tactics. Yeah, and baseball I'll be talking about shit is bush league. Y'all bush league. Mm-hmm. Um. They're going to kill one of these Astros with a 100 mile per hour curveball or some yeah, it's shit. Gonna, they, the league going to have to do something about So that it. is my question to y'all. How many out of 182 games, how many of those games is a pitcher going <laughs> to throw at an Astro? Probably. And I'm serious. These are the hard hitting sports probably, topics probably 50%. that they should be asking on ESPN, but I don't hear it. Probably 50%. Of I, the talk about the I say 50% too. Yeah. It might I, be higher. I, I do say 50%. I think the league is, I think the players are really angry about that. <laughs> fucking Kurt, you know how much shit fucking uh, Kershaw had to, uh, the Dodgers pitcher, Clayton Cl- Kershaw had to take yeah. for being being the winningest pitcher who can't get it done in the, in the, in the playoffs but the, the, because he was going against a team that knew all the signals. They put out a stat <laughs> that said, that said <laughs> that the Astros didn't swing at or miss. Any one of Clayton Kershaw's fucking, what's his? Wow. <laughs> they didn't swing at it or miss it when they did. Wow. His breaking ball. But the bat- if you're not him, you're not going to want your Dodgers pitchers oh, no, for to sure. take, their fucking, take their heads off. Fucking uh, but the bad Mike part Trout, about that- who never talks, got in an interview three weeks ago and was mad. Said, no, nah, I'm mad about that shit. 
He don't never talk. No, they should be that. mad. They should be. But the bad part is you don't know how to Aaron gauge. Aaron Judge knew ass. But you don't know how to gauge if it's on purpose or not, if they throw it at the, at the batter. You know. Fam. You can't know. It's, it's <laughs> if it happens every night. Then. It, no, now that's purposely. But if in the game, if sometimes you, you lose control of a pitch. So it's like that's where it's going to become tricky for the league to get a hold of it because I could be on the mound and be like, I wasn't trying to intentionally throw at him. Like, Just look fam, at that fan. It that happens. was directly at him. Fam. <laughs> that didn't slip. Look. <laughs> and, and on top of that He's aiming for the face He's not even aiming for the leg Damn, Yeah get out of here And he just wanted the ball back He ain't feel bad enough Yo 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 it's yo, of, yo, it happens. Me. Let me get that back Same one Yeah you cheating ass Get your little dingy ass Too close to the plate Yeah I am gonna watch I am gonna watch baseball too close. He's far away from the plate <laughs> No so what So what Still too close Watch, watch yourself Alright that was my, I don't know how the league didn't, The league has to do something about that though. They, what do you think they should do that title shouldn't what can stand. You do? I'm sorry. Yes. Uh, you can well, do the title anything. shouldn't stand. That title shouldn't stand. You, you can do some weird shit like it. immediate ejections instead of warnings. Oh no, we're talking about the with the title thing. Oh, the championship. Oh, okay. they, they were talking about what they do. Yeah, they got they it. They just they keep should, getting pegged with baseball. That. That's fucked up though for the Dodgers or whoever else was in contention and for and it. Should, like, should P. Rose be allowed in the Hall of Fame now? Yes. He definitely. I've been saying that before. Before the Astros, but now it's like he definitely should be allowed in. Well, no, you're saying P. Rose allowed in the Hall of Fame. P. Rose should be allowed back in baseball activities. No, no. stadiums. <laughs> yeah, he's, but, he's banned from the sport. But yeah. the Hall of Fame, for sure. He's one of the greatest hitters ever. Like I'd say the same thing about Barry Bonds, but whatever. Yeah. I think Bonds and Clemens, and a few of them should still be in. But You got to give all them steroid dudes to, uh, to end. Why, why not? Yo, he, baseball loves Jose. cheating. Baseball yeah. loves cheating. I don't know why they why they do this. That was the best the era best of baseball. Era ep- yeah, bring it back. Yeah. <laughs> It was the best era yeah. of baseball by far. Yeah. Yeah, Maguire and Sosa that year. What? It was definitely the best era of baseball. And then Bonds a, a couple years later? Yeah. That yeah. was the shit. It's true. That's when it was lit. OD. I don't watch baseball for shit now. But this, I might watch because of this. And, and what's, this is what's be the fun. problem if everyone's <laughs> this, doing it? This right. is going to be interesting. They're going to they gonna get hurt. They're going to hurt themselves. Yeah. Um. Well, yeah, while we on, while we on, while we on sports, uh, sports, give us your uh, James Harden versus Greek Freak tape. Are you familiar? To our audience yeah. out there, all, All-Star all Weekend, uh, Greek Freak and LeBron James were the two captains picking the teams. Uh, Charles Barkley and Greek Freak got into a, a, a conversation mm-hmm. when a few names were left on the board and Greek Freak took Kimba Walker ahead of James Harden. Mm-hmm. And Barkley <laughs> said, hey, you don't want the dribbler? And then they both had like an inside joke laugh. And then Greek Freak said, no, I want the guy who's going to pass the ball. Mm-hmm. Um. And then Greek Freak said something else that I thought was a little slick, but I don't remember it right now, so that's fine. Uh, fast forward, now we have a James Harden interview with, uh, who's that girl I like? Uh, huh? Rachel, Rachel Nichols. Nichols. Rachel Nichols. Rachel Nichols. Mm-hmm. Uh, and she asked him about it, and that's why I like Rachel Nichols. Boy, does she get right to the shit. Mm-hmm. So, did you hear what Homeboy said? Yeah. She don't uh, get around the bush. Yeah. Did you hear what James James said? Uh, that he averaged more assists than Kimba or something like that? Yeah, he said he, av- uh, he averages more assists than Kimba. Uh, and he went on to say, "Well, I would I would love to be a seven foot dude who just runs and dunks mm-hmm. like that. Don't take any skill." Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, no. He said, "I I got to actually learn how to play basketball." <laughs> yeah, I, I like give it. Give it to us. I like it. It's, I think it's fun. I think it's you know that spicy talk is needed in the league. Um, but I don't think that Giannis was was wrong for taking Kimba in that situation. I think that was a the smarter player to take. He don't, he didn't necessarily need another score. Well, and it was clear he was trying to take I a mean, bunch of people from the East too. So yeah, it's an All Star game. Yeah, everyone so everyone is a scorer to some yeah. degree. So I mean, I get it, but I, I like I like this type of shit though. This is this is good for the NBA. Good, good, good. While we're on sports, let's stay here for a second. Off mic a few weeks ago, you came to me, or you came to this podcast and shared something with us in confidence that you heard a player. Or players say, right? Can't remember what that was. I know okay. that's good. Good. Mm-hmm. I don't want you to. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then that player played the other player, and I haven't seen anybody talk about it. This is cryptic. And I want to talk about. It. Let's talk about. I'm it. talking about the Lakers Pelicans game. Okay. I haven't yeah. seen anybody really talk about what happened in that oh, game. Oh yes, yes, yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that was. Speak uh, to it, please. <laughs> you remember what you said? Yeah. 
And you saw that game. Lakers Pelicans, yes. Give us honest feedback of what you saw. Um, but before this game, though, I, I told you uh, Zion, uh, Zion looked good. I do think that he has to get in shape. He looking, to- looking good and bullying Antonio Davis on offense and defense for an entire game are two different things. Yeah, I mean, and I don't hear anybody talking about how Zion manhandled Antonio Davis that entire game. I mean, uh, Antonio Davis, <laughs> Anthony, Anthony Davis. Still having nightmares from that Knicks series. <laughs> Fam, um, yo, that that, that Indiana front court is so underrated. The Davis boys and Rick Smiths. Yeah, yeah. With Reggie Miller and Mark Jackson, it's a they should they should have had a title. It's a squad. With but, um, Wayman Tisdale off the, well, not Wayman Tisdale. Who's that bald fucking guy? I hated off the bench. Hey, he was a hey, would fucking. He's work. a ref now, huh? He's a ref now. Oh, good for him. Yeah, he's a ref in NBA. Um. Yeah, Zion, I think that uh, a lot of players in the NBA, until they get on the floor with him, they don't exactly know how uh, strong he is and how quick he is. I think it's kind of like, you don't, it's like deceptive. You don't see it, but then when he, you feel a body bump against you, you like, damn, like, first of all, it's a lot of weight, but then it's a lot, like, he's strong. It's not like he's just fat, and then he's athletic, so it's like, you're not... Wait, you, dude, I, I th- think I just saw AD say pardon me and just move. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a that's a, my fault, bro. That's a, that's, a, that's a lot. That's a lot coming at you right there. So, okay. I mean, I'm I'm pretty sure, but it's I can't put too much into that. It's the first time. All I'm saying is, as it pertains to the take that we yes. won't say, that was wrong. That's it. That was wrong. Yeah. That's it. But he does have to get in shape. I think if he loses about thirty pounds, he's gonna he's gonna be Gotta a real problem. Averaging thirty and thirty. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying. <laughs> so imagine if he's in shape. You was on that side of that take though. I was wrong. Yeah. I was wrong. Yeah, he, he should did. still lose some weight, though. He has to. He definitely has to lose weight. But he's uh, like I said, it's deceptive. You get out there, you don't realize until he run up and down and bump into you a few times. You're like, oh shit. But yeah, I don't put too much stock into that, Joe. That was one game. That was one game. One game, one game to you. I just saw him bully Hassan Whiteside the week before that. <laughs> I've seen him I'm, bully I'm a bunch about, of big dudes. No, but. yeah, no, for sure. But I'm talking about in yeah, got it, got it, got it. That game. All right, what you think will happen in that game? Don't worry about it. It's not a sports podcast. Oh no, we'll he's to it. he's playing. He's playing like really well. Low management. Surprise me. Low management for AD next game against the Pelicans. Mm. Now what? <laughs> no, I don't. Now think what? So. I don't think now so. what? I don't think so. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't think so. We're not going to do that. But if that happens, what what do you take? Will you take something from that? Absolutely. That's it. All right. That's it. Absolutely. Got it. All right, Rory. I gave you at least. 25 minutes to find our next topic. <laughs> okay. I have a question for y'all. When you're getting busy on FaceTime with Shorty and you getting nut busy. and you nut Whoa. and she's still in her zone, <laughs> what do you guys do? Damn, you killing that. <laughs> you gotta talk her You just it. start saying weird shit. You gotta talk her through. You are so sexy. <laughs> Help out. Encourage her. Act like someone's at the door. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, but what, but what happens when she says, I want to see something too and you're like, yeah, I've been nutted. <laughs> <laughs> I'm with I'm with Maul. I'm with I'm with Maul. You, co- Sexy you talk. talk her through it. Sexy talk. But sometimes shit, if she go on hand for long enough, I'll try to rub another one out. Yeah. It's the two for Get one. Get back in the game. Yeah, yeah. I love it. Get two back for in one. the game. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do some jumping see, jacks. You see, you see it, man. Yeah, yeah. Glass of water, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Get back in the game. Yeah, get right back in the game. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. Get back in the game. That's nasty. I'm Get the guy to complain. I, I'll, I complain. <laughs> I'll complain to the girl. It was not fair. You take that long to come. <laughs> Word. Like, honestly, shorten it up. Yeah. Or. Get to know yourself. Or, <laughs> or I've, I've done. You go. You come first. We can't keep doing it this way. Because mm. once I come, in general, I'm hanging up. Yeah, in general, you want to. You, they should go first. You come first because I'm going to be lusty through this whole shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh right. can't wait for you. But if I go first. Yeah, no, sorry. No. Sorry, Queen. Yeah. Now I'm sitting here like, yeah, what you doing? <laughs> yeah. I got shit to do today. You start cracking jokes and shit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at your face when you come in. You look mad stupid. <laughs> you ever have g- great FaceTime <laughs> sex? Yo, all right. What is wrong with you? We said? No, he's right, though. <laughs> look at your face when you come in. You look mad stupid. <laughs> <laughs> talking to her. You can't, that? <laughs> R- Rory, you can't talk. What's that, that nuggets you, out there? You can say she got Jordans on. <laughs> nah, I told her to keep those on. What the fuck are you talking about? Look how Rory talked to this bitch. The chicken heels is not having it with Rory. <laughs> Y'all are sick. Bro. Oh, man. This is funny. Uh, this is a good one. But on. I can't keep on it because I'll incriminate myself. 
Mo, have you noticed that every chick in the last year has become crip? Huh? Um, I'm learning. It, there's a surge. It's like a busy Uber night. This what are you talking at about? At one point, every chick was brazy. Mm-hmm. Now I'm getting double C's on the back, and I know your mother. Yeah. yeah. Like, we went to middle school together. Yeah. Why are you a crip at 29? And I knew you your whole life. <laughs> you never did any gang activity. Every chick is doing the double C thing now. Yeah. I get Y'all follow some wild chicks. <laughs> they got Jordans on. Jordan <laughs> ones. <laughs> All the Crips with Jordan ones. <laughs> no, don't you, you're trying to get me killed. <laughs> yeah, well, what I'm the, just saying. What's up, Rachel? I'm talking about the women. But I'm not talking about the, no, I'm not talking about the. No, I'm just talking about the women. The women He's have a gangbang, that's all. Black. Yeah, no, don't try to get me killed. I'm staying alive for a little bit. No, keep talking, Rory, about the Crip bitches. No, I just posed a question. I've, I've, I've noticed a, yeah. a, a, a change in text messages. Whoever the hottest rappers are at the moment, and whatever gang they're affiliated with, that's who the women side with. Gotcha. Yeah. I liked it when they just had OVO chains on, man. <laughs> it was times it was much so, it was so much more safer. It was, it was safer, safer, safer times for sure. <laughs> Put the owl back on. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> get, get, get the get the Jordan Drake collab. Get the OVO threes. <laughs> I don't see how we always have these talks and the Dreamville crew just goes unsaid. Why? Because they're earthy. Yeah. Got it. They just mind their own business. Oh, no, no, no. I, I leave. See, come on. You, you know how I feel about the earthy joints. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I leave them alone. I don't want to slander them on here. Them Dreamville boys is, is in the streets, man. Mm. Allegedly. Are they? Allegedly. Allegedly, of course. Allegedly, Allegedly. of course. Okay. I don't know. I don't want to talk to them. I may or may not have went to a uh, a Dreamville Grammy thing in LA, and it, they was in there. Fam, <laughs> it went up like it was a Tuesday. <laughs> I didn't know that. Wrong, wrong click. I didn't know Dreamville was out there like that. <laughs> They're definitely out there. Why, why wouldn't they be? I didn't yo, know you have, was yo, out there like that, honestly. Have you ever been in Greystone with chicks that like lyrics? Yes. <laughs> shit is fire. Great times. Great times. <laughs> yeah, we was in, in Bootsy Bella, however you pronounce that shit. Bootsy Bellows? Them chicks was rapping everywhere. <laughs> but to like some conscious shit. <laughs> <laughs> like I got to know them. <laughs> what kind of shoes do they have on? <laughs> Bitches rapping the light aggressively. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like a great night. <laughs> Yo, he's killing the Dilla set. <laughs> nah, chill. I'm chilling up. <laughs> Roy laughing too hard. You ain't fucked up. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead. You love the Dilla yeah, set, so who are you laughing? I had a blast at that club. <laughs> so, Candyman. I'm hype. I'm not. No? Wait, is Roy? Oh, hold up, man. We ain't done this in a while. Hold up, hold up. <laughs> oh. oh, man. I forgot this was even a thing for us. Yes. Yes. Mike check. Mike check. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Hey, I know it's been a while since we played this. Been a while since somebody took a bold stance out there on the ledge. Uh, Hey. All right, I'll do it. Go up down in the Bronx. A boogie down was strong in the ass for the... Oh my God! Why did I? He was the greatest rapper ever when I put that together when I was half old. <laughs> oh, he did the burrows. <laughs> what? That did it for That's me. That's hard. Back. That did it for me back then. It did it for a long time. So, so how come? Yeah. Was, how come he was feeling that way when Papoose had uh, New York in the palm of his hand? What song was that? Uh, the whatever that Buster record that was really touch it that the oh. banks him. bust up what it is right. That's oh. not touch it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great record though. <laughs> this nigga just this nigga went crazy on a raw record just now. <laughs> you lost your oh, mind. Oh, Busted out past the Cavassi, eh? <laughs> You got puff on your mind all the time. Yeah. Oh my. Oh. Jesus. <laughs> Filthy. Anyways, Candy Bro, you Man, better not take your ass to none of them making the band auditions either. What if I want to be in the band? <laughs> nope. Don't go. But I know what Joe. What you playing? The band. That's the instrument you play the band. Yeah. Okay. I can get you. Scream, man. We're going to hit that Brie girl. <laughs> Casey was like over there, like festering about it. Yeah, you keep putting you keep putting Scotty on the screen. You know, Scream Man DM me like, yo, they wilding at the pod right now. <laughs> lock your account. Lock your account. I yo. Told- <laughs> yo. Scream Man. Lock, lock your account. Yo, lock your account. Yo, off mic, I told them to chill. <laughs> Oh my God, that's funny. Uh oh, all right, yeah, we on my take. Yeah, can't even. We're uh, on, you know, we got five takes when you give it to us. I'll start with love. Mm. I love Key and Peele. Great comedy show. Enjoyed it. 
Jordan Peele's movies stink. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> That's where you went? Suckers get smacked up. <laughs> okay. This movie stink, man. The end, like, uh, I get the meaning and the overall arching narrative. I get it, and that's dope, and I love it. But the movies themselves stink. What do you think about movies black people love? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for a response. <laughs> that's fucked up how you flip pre-production into that. Yeah, juice, a little, a little, a little juice. I can never trust you again. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm with you, though. It's, it's fucking trash. <laughs> I've been saying it for mad law. I, I support him. I do too. And I want him to do great. They do great. They do, he doesn't need me, in my opinion. But fam, I think just, he's, he's just, doing pro, just I think fine. he's just producing this one for what it's worth. So? <laughs> okay. Yeah, I like, no, they're not getting me with this, this again. <laughs> just some black dude having a rough morning. <laughs> no. I'm not doing it because Say My Name got horrified. <laughs> He tricked you with a. Uh, I got five my on name, it. Say my no. <laughs> well, I got five, but that was hard. I, I do, was. I, I that was like, hard. I do like that trend of that of making your. Song I like to say my name. Spooky. Slip too. Yeah, yeah that's hard. Yeah. I do like that. No, it's dope. I'm not watching Jordan Peele movies. I'm cool. That's bro. it. Just because uh, what was it called? Us. <laughs> that movie was. Like. I'm not. I'm not fucking a chick wearing Jordans, nope. and I'm not watching during a, us a Jordan Peele movie. <laughs> Should issue with Jordan, man. <laughs> Look at this guy. He got fucking Ibaka in here. <laughs> <laughs> Rory laughing too hard at movies black people <laughs> like. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> oh, boy. So y'all on the ledge with me. I'm going to go see that shit. Mm-hmm. I love Candyman. <laughs> you y'all scared of Candyman when y'all was young? Of course. <laughs> I saw someone tweet. How y'all scared of someone you have to request to kill you? (laughs) (laughs) All right. Yeah, we got sleepers. I'm getting out of here, man. That makes sense. (laughs) That that makes sense. (laughs) Dead as hell. Like, you could just not say shit. Look at these guys in the bathroom with sneakers on. Get out of here. (laughs) (laughs) Look at Yes Jules. <laughs> Look at her right there. <laughs> oh, oh! <sighs> this has been a. <laughs> I, was, I really like this podcast today. <laughs> yeah, I'm with you. It's been a, been a little toxic, but <laughs> it's all right. Welp. <laughs> Anything else, you guys? Let's look at the Holy list. Holy shit, man! This was funny. Uh, yeah, I think that's about it. Uh, yeah. We gotta shave our beards. <laughs> <laughs> What's Park's segment? <laughs> we gotta shave our beards. Oh, that's important. Yeah, yeah. That, that's, right, that, we that's gotta important. shave our beards. Yeah, let's talk to the Parks. <laughs> Parks, tell us what's important this week. Uh, oh, our Black History uh, segment we gotta do. That's true. Uh, the O in front of that after the Jordan Peele hate where are you really asking for it I'm trying to clean it up <laughs> <laughs> trying to be balanced the, here the O should be silent next time apparently Clips' <laughs> former manager said that all the raps are about him and I don't really care wasn't that said mad long ago probably I still like the raps is my point I, yeah I don't care <laughs> <laughs> weirdo <laughs> okay Clips' former manager <laughs> no, no. Now Steve, that is no, some Steve, narcissistic shit. No, Stephen Victor said that. Said so what? <laughs> Stephen <laughs> Victor did not say that. <laughs> I, I got nothing else. Oh. <laughs> all right, all right. We going home, man. Don't there. worry about it. Hey, uh, let me play right, a song. Come on, give a give your Black History Month award to Jay Z or someone else obvious <laughs> <laughs> that you've been doing all month. And I'd like to give this one to Barack Obama. I don't think he's gotten enough flowers <laughs> as the first black president. <laughs> no. Your picks have sucked. I'm picking, I'm picking people that, one, are alive. <laughs> that, two, really inspire me and that are in the field that I'm looking to gain knowledge from. That's what I'm picking. That's and cool. I'm picking people who have the ability to actually 
receive the flowers. I like it. Like, hear them. I like it. Y'all been fucking funeraling me to death. Hey, in 1901, <laughs> Frederick Baker <laughs> was the first. You leave Frederick Baker name, out of this. First person to come up with a camera. I'm like, man, he dead as hell. You just Googled this nigga. How's the inspiration, Frederick Baker? But all right, cool. Hey, I want to shout out Elizabeth G, who in 1940, <laughs> like, y'all just, just say shout money, man. <laughs> like, come on. Let's just say Jay-Z. Like, just say the people that we know and that inspire us, really. We really? don't have to take, make everything deep. My, mine today <laughs> is that. Yeah, perfect. Uh, are you, you going to play the song or are we just going to get into it? Hit it, Jack. You're Jack. I'm Jack, yeah. <laughs> the hook rock on these fools. These fools. <laughs> You're so old. <laughs> <laughs> Only you catch this stuff from me. <laughs> that was another clause of mine for re- retiring from rap. Like, once you like have a hard time keeping up with the slang, you should chill. Yeah. Because <laughs> verses need slang. They do. They do. It's you don't want to hear like an old dude saying the young slang. You don't. It's, it's, it's nastiness. Yeah, it's filth. It's nastiness. Yeah. Uh, all right. I don't want to hear Cap from Red Man. This week for our Black History Month inspo. <laughs> inspo. <laughs> you may have heard of this Sean before. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not going with Jay-Z. But Jay-Z should be there, so that's fucked no, up. No, you're going with Sean Combs. <laughs> Jay-Z and Puff should be there. Of course they should. Um, And they are definitely two inspirations to me. But... <laughs> Uh, I'm going Dave Chappelle. Mm-hmm. I'm going Dave Chappelle. Another known name out there. Uh, I don't need to talk about the work he's done, the road he's traveled. Uh, but again, somebody else who just does it on their own terms. There's something to be said for walking away from probably the biggest deal you've ever received from a, a network television, mm-hmm. uh, from from linear TV, and walking away from it. At the peak and, of your show. At yeah, at the height of your show, not really giving a fuck about perception, what the public thinks, just to take the correct stance uh, against the network. That was and disappear for five years. The discipline it takes to do that, um, just just the the state of mind that you have to be in to accomplish that, only to come back and still get that same money from Netflix to sell out to do nine shows in a weekend at Radio City. Like, what Dave Chappelle is doing is, is we've never seen it before. We've no. never seen it before. Uh, thank you, Dave. The way he taps into to the culture, uh, the jo- the role he played in putting on some of our favorite hip-hop acts, uh, mm-hmm. putting a, uh, making sure Hell a light yeah. was shined on them, uh, his festival. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, Dave, is, Dave is, is connected. I think all of the people that I've named... Throughout, throughout this uh, segment, they've been pretty hands-on and connected with all things black culture. Uh, I want to thank Dave Chappelle for his contribution uh, and say I appreciate him. Yeah, I like the pick. I, I think turning down that 50 mil is talked about so much, but mm. not in the correct way. Not at all. Yeah. Like, it's always, damn, it's crazy you walked away from that. What the fuck? And then you see the reasoning and still coming back to get that money times three. Yeah, it's, I don't it's, think it's, I don't think Jordan Pill even gets this success without the stance that Dave Chappelle took. Yeah. I think I think there's a few people there's a few people like that. Shout out to Dave, man. And he spends his money mad cool. Like he does those fucking speaking of his festival, he does those jam sessions with like Prince's band where it's mm-hmm. no no phone in the middle of a farm in Ohio. And like everyone perform, that's like how I would want to spend yeah. <laughs> my hundred mil. He, he's celebrities, right? He does. Yeah, like he he's does. celebrities the right way. He he goes on Saturday Night Live, smokes a joint, like <laughs> he just does what the fuck he wants to do. Yeah, and even if it wasn't a joint, so he smoked something. Something was, something was flammable. <laughs> yeah, up there. Uh, and still has my favorite interview of all time: the Inside the Actor Studio with Chappelle is is my favorite interview to this day. Uh, I'm gonna go with a uh, Top Dog. We'll go with Top Dog, uh, founder of TDE. Who's that, Rory? Oh. <laughs> I just said the founder of, founder of TDE. Break it down for him. Top Dog, the founder of Top Dog Entertainment. Um, from his story, his background, even starting with J-Rock, get, getting a shit deal with Warner and, and getting out of that and coming back and, and building 
the uh, the roster we know now with Kendrick, J Rock, Absol, Schoolboy Q, and, and kind of sticking to their guns and creating an entire new movement. Um, I love how Top Dog just moves. Like I think it reflects how his whole crew moves. They label right. Yeah, yeah. They just Top Dog. I don't think gets talked about in. Every time people bring up like, yo, we need the old exec backs, like we need the Dame and the Irvs, like how come we don't have that? I'm like, no, we got Top Dog right there doing it. He just doesn't do it loudly. Yeah. But he does it correctly. <laughs> mm-hmm. I, I don't think he gets enough credit because he's not looking for it. He just quietly yeah. moves better than everyone else. NP. Top and P. Yeah. Yeah. So shout out to uh to Top Dog, man. Dope. Definitely. Uh I'm a salute Ice Cube. I like it. I'm salute Ice Cube, man. I think everything that he's doing with the big three, I think, is groundbreaking. Um, everything he's done in film, coming from where, they, where he came from, the era in uh, music that they, I mean, the feds were, like, trying to shut down N.W.A. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's seen a lot. He's seen a lot. And coming through this culture, that's not easy to do and last as long as he has. And I think that he's somebody that we don't talk about in our culture enough and we don't give enough uh, respect to. So I'm going to shout out and salute Ice Cube. I like it. I like that pick too. Legend. Super legend. Yeah. yeah. And especially like those solo albums. Yeah. What he was talking about to yeah. to how he's accepted now. Underrated. It's under, crazy. He's an underrated West Coast artist as well. Absolutely. Somehow. Yeah. yeah. I don't know how. Oh, but shit. He is. He's a is that top, true? Top 15, oh, yeah. period. That can't be true. That's not true. I'm telling I'm not, you. I'm not a lot of people, nah, nah, lot of people I think I'm wrong with talk about Cube when they bring up they West Coast rappers. Yeah. They don't. In that immediate conversation. I'm just telling you, they don't. Every time I bring it up, dudes from the West Coast look at me like, I'm like, well, I don't know how y'all don't feel that way, but okay. Yeah, but you, you must be talking to children from the West Coast. No, I mean, it's a few older ones do too. I mean, they be like, yeah, okay. Like, it takes some persuading, I guess, and they shouldn't. That's my problem. Like, Got Cube it. is definitely one of the elite West Coast MCs. No, he's one of the elite MCs. Okay, yeah. yeah. I'm with you on that. But yeah. period. We talking he about should be in everyone's top ten at least fifteen the yeah, most. At least 15. fifteen. I said fifteen. I agree. No, I agree. Yeah. I agree. And, that, and that's why I said like underrated. Maybe not talked I, about enough. Yeah. Yeah. I still throw in the underrated. I think he's a little bit underrated. He is. Not talked about enough to me does not mean underrated. Because think, once you say his name, in at least in the circles I travel in, you give it up. Like it's yeah, but it's like when you say his name, people are like, oh, yeah. It's like, how do y'all f- forget about him so, like, frequently? <laughs> like, it's just crazy to me. You know what happens, I think, sometimes? I think people get, and it's a weird concept, they get so successful that people will be forgetting mm-hmm. about what happened before because he's so successful currently at something else. Right. Like, Ice Cube <laughs> is in that, that uh, if they died after two album conversation that Roy loves to have with... Uh, America's most in death certificate. For yeah. sure. And if you're unfamiliar with Ice Cube, start there. And that guy is still with us because he's done so much since those two albums too. Mm-hmm. Musically Hell and yeah. creatively in every field imaginable, honestly. Yeah. Ice Cube looks great. Like, And that's the other thing we don't talk about enough. Like, our legends that look and sound great still. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, his skin looks great. His eyes look great. He's still active. He's still in the OG role, past mm-hmm. now information. He's still putting people on. Like, mm-hmm. he just does it in a manner... Kind of like Hove, like just under the radar. And we don't give West Side Connection. It's it's due. I'm going to find a way to give Hove props and everything. <laughs> <laughs> I have to stop that. Yeah. Except for football. You don't think he's a good football player? I'm not giving Hove props when it comes to the NFL. Like playing? I could have done without Shakir. Sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm going to do another batch thing. Uh Yo, you lost to... I'm sorry, Parks. Yeah. Scream, man, you lost to a dude that got on the <laughs> mic and screamed, Shakira, Shakira! So it was a that smash. That was fire, though. But you're not supposed to lose a battle to that guy. <laughs> I mean, that's true. In 2020. Wyclef could rap, though. No, listen. Matter we of jo- fact... We joking around here, but Wyclef is exactly the dude that you don't want to battle. Like, yeah. Wyclef... Well, oh, Wyclef I used to know. I don't know about today. Would freestyle off the head, just start saying some crazy shit. He would. He was ill with the freaking languages. Bilingual, yeah, shit, like trilingual, you didn't want to battle Wyclef, but yeah. it is funny to lose to, to Wyclef. In I don't know. I don't know if I'm, I'm cool losing to a dude that lost in an argument to Claudette Ortiz in two wrongs. <laughs> she won that argument. You would let her win the argument. I would. Mo, you still on her? That's still your. Absolutely. It should be. She look great. Absolutely. Call me. You put India Love in that boat. Shut up. India Love is sexy too. What's wrong with you, man? It's only one sexy girl out. No. Oh, okay. 
Is that what I said? Oh, you made it seem that way. It's just different classes. I like different different classes. <laughs> okay. Different classes of sexy. Uh, yeah. They, so they, some they would they say, are. at least by perception. Right. Because I don't know any of these people. <laughs> yeah. Um, well, I want to do mine. I'm sorry, Parks. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to do another batch. And it's not all my other people, but it's you, DJ Premier, and Showbiz. Thank you. Oh, For everything you've done. Seriously. Well, thank you, Parks. I, it's pretty cool. I appreciate that. You're welcome. I never get thanked for anything. <laughs> Uh, so no one's gonna do Styles P. So you're gonna interrupt. <laughs> so the one time I do get thanked, you just want to step on it. Yeah. Let it let it breathe. Uh, yeah. Let it just let it breathe. What are let, friends let, for? Let the beat rock. Something. <laughs> shout out to Styles P too. One hundred percent shout out to Styles. Always shout out to Styles. Um. Tony Romo just got 17 mil a year from CBS, according to STD. Whew. Congratulations to Tony Romo. Well deserved. If I'm Stephen A, I'm losing my fucking mind. But well, do we know what he he got? Ten, right? Is that what that was reported? Uh, it was reported he got eight. He got eight. It was reported he got eight. Oh shit! It was reported that he asked for ten and landed at eight. To do <sighs> to do 24 hours, 365 days. That's crazy. <laughs> and Tony Romo does a season. Well, a black guy gonna always have to do more for his buck. But that's a big I, fucking difference. Well, ESPN, all I'm saying is Stephen A. CBS deserves more way more than, than eight million dollars. CBS has more money than ESPN. I would. You think so? ESPN? No, I don't not know. Not Disney. That. CB. Oh, not okay. Disney. Yeah, okay. Not I'm Disney. lumping him in the D. Yeah. Either Disney, way, ESPN has more ABC. than eight million dollars to give to their number one priority. Um, I would think so. I, I would think that he would deserve several multiples of that. Yes. And Tony Romo deserves a lot of money too because yeah, he's, he's phenomenal he's at what he does. But I, Stephen I need a. more than eight just for just for me doing first take five days a week. Fam. What? But before Without you get question. into anything else that I do. You could get into that show. and then one of the sixteen other shows or sixteen yeah. other hours that he is on TV a day. Yeah. First take is worth more than eight. Yeah. Yeah. It's That's true. That's sick. <sighs> but Tony Romo's really good at that shit, man. He's really good. He's, he's really good. I, I, no complaints from me about what he got. Yeah. Probably, probably could have got more. <laughs> it's quarterback money. Retirement. That's ill. Yeah, yeah I, listen, I can't wait. Backup to, quarterback I, money, but still, good good money. <laughs> to talk? It's more than with John, uh, John Madden, mate. Wow. Well, John Madden, that was some time ago. Yeah, yeah I could see that, probably eight, that 8 million now. being and that 17 probably didn't, with inflation. That probably didn't factor in his uh, EA endorsement shit. Oh, there you go. That's sick. <laughs> congratulations to Yeah, uh, congratulations. Congratulations to Tony Romo, regardless. Um I don't have anything else, guys. Uh somehow I think we, we I, could sleep her. Happy leap year, guys. Yeah, Shadow means Ja Rule is what, fifteen now? <laughs> <laughs> he was born on leap year, right? It was yeah. That know. makes sense. I think so. <laughs> that was a great topic for the intro to this song. Leap year? <laughs> Jaru being 15. <laughs> look, look at you. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure one of us said something in this podcast to get us canceled. Oh, absolutely. absolutely. I'm positive of it. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> is that cancel thing still a real thing? Nah. It never really was, is a thing. Nah, not if you got melanin. <laughs> the only person that ever really got cancer was Chrisette Michelle, right? <laughs> what? She was the only one that they stuck with it. But <laughs> I love Chrisette, but they wasn't checking for her before the Trump. Oh, okay. <laughs> Where's Chrisette Michelle? <laughs> cancel University? <laughs> Not at Rock Nation brunch. <laughs> All right. <laughs> she could have sang for Hillary, she wouldn't have been there. <laughs> oh, all right. Listen. As she rises through her apology, anybody else would surely know. Shout out to Chrisette nah, we Michelle. should surely oh. know, but we don't. <laughs> Savon, you ain't defend Scream Man. You didn't defend what Chrisette Michelle from Long me. Island. Like, <laughs> wow, wow. <laughs> See, oh man, white soul. This is our Earth, Wind, and Fire. <laughs> <laughs> huh? This is our earth, wind, and fire. <laughs> One dude. <laughs> earth, wind, and fire. He's all of them. 
<laughs> oh, man. Listen, man, this was fun. I'm going home. I'm getting out of here. Y'all enjoy your weekend. No streets for you tonight? No, 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 no. Bitches made me mad. You don't get no tip money. It's dry out there when I'm mad. <laughs> Damn, nobody eat, nobody, eat tonight. Nah, no, nobody can eat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Connect to Wi Fi, Ma. Your, your well, phone bill not getting paid. Yeah, so, sorry, Ma. Just sit there on your phone. No, I'm not going to your bar tonight. Yeah, text back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, by the way. Uh, keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there until the next time. Hasta la vista. Peace. Adios. Arriva derchi. So long. Goodbye. All that good shit. Uh, life is a series of moments and moments pass, so let's make this one last as if it's all we have. Hope you enjoyed this podcast. We will talk to y'all on Wednesday. Until then, is anything happening? Anything happening this weekend? I don't think so. Nah. Nah. Not really. I don't Not think really. so. It's quiet out there. Just me picking what chick from the OnlyFans leak is going to get it, get it this hour. <laughs> Got to switch it up hourly on them. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Y'all got queens, man. Y'all don't have to live like such <laughs> savages. No, you don't have to live that way. No, yes, I do. I went to CVS and picked up all five of the lubes. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like a different chick, kind of? A different, different lube, different chick? <laughs> no, because CVS got their own, the CVS she version. You do not want the CVS brand Of lube. the lube. So they trying not to stock up on the wet platinum shit. So when they have it, you got to get it. So, you got five of them. <laughs> so, you're mad that Shorty camped out for sneakers, but you camping out for the wet plat? <laughs> no, I'm not camping out. It's there. In, in, the, in the drawer right next to the bed. Wait right here. <laughs> wait right here. <laughs> yeah, wait right here while I lean over and get it. <laughs> Can we end this? Huh? Can we end this? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Air horns, bitch. Hit the bread. Oh. <laughs> After the bridge, we're getting out of here, I promise. Just going to wait for some news to break in the next 10 minutes. Uh, who else gives it to you in real time? <laughs> here we go. Let me hear you. <laughs> what key was that part? <laughs> oh, what y'all doing tonight? Anything fun? Huh? 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 Nope. Nah. It's cold out there, bro. It's, it's cold facts. out there in the house. Fuck that. I'm sure Roman probably drag me somewhere I want to go. Yeah, it's still. It's, it might be early. Yeah, it's still. it is early. Just <laughs> gonna drive by all bad, <laughs> bad bunnies. Uh, favorite bad bunny drops. Bad, favorite like New York spots. Three hours. I'm hype. Really? Yeah. Oh, I was about to be lit. <laughs> I was about to be lit, lit. Wait, Litter and lit. Why didn't he? Okay, yeah. Because he wanted to drop on Leap, yeah. Got gotcha. you. Got gotcha. you. Not seeing the marketing. Yeah. No, I got it. I picked up on it. <laughs> leap year. See what fans leap to go get it. Mm. Uh, You got an outfit in mind for when it drops? He wears a lot of weird outfits. So black t-shirt, really, black jeans. Yeah, probably. Yeah, yeah. Probably some. <laughs> probably so, switch it up on him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Maybe some out the plastic, though. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Give him something new. Something black or, a black or black. Yeah, something without the bacon, yeah. bacon neck. <laughs> Your bacon neck on a black tee is <laughs> tough, man. It's been a long if you day. can see the bacon in the black. How did he do that? It's, it's been a long day. Bacon. <laughs> <laughs> That's, it's been a long day. You worked a lot today. Play. We're getting out of here, man. Enjoy your weekend. Have a good time. We'll talk to you fucktards, fuckies, and fuckets on Wednesday, man. <laughs> <laughs>